Hey everybody, how are you? I'm good, thanks for asking. We're playing some Crash Nitro Kart tonight. Keris is eating ice off camera. <laughs> Phoebe is also with us. We, okay, so something I forgot to do in the last sessions is I was meant to do the, the challenges that involve getting the tokens where you go around and break all the boxes in mini games. So we're gonna do them at the start of every world, then do the rest of the actual tokens, the CNK things. Then we're gonna do, go through the beginning. Then we're gonna go back to the beginning of the game and do the relics. I'm gonna guess two more sessions of this game. My guess, anyway. How are we doing, everybody? Hey Zach. Hey Ian. Hey El Eloka. I'm doing. No, El Coco. Coca. Oh, I'm sorry. I can't read. Uh, we've we've also got Renato C. Francisco. Thank you so much for the two month resub. And the funny thing is, I know I know the emoji, <laughs> but it just says good, 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 good. <laughs> That's all I'm seeing. That the text is just saying good, 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 good. Da Acorn, thank you for the two ninety nine Australian. Cash never, it's cash Cash never Luka. come is my third favorite crash racing game. That's funny because there's only three of them. Um, Silas Schizo, thank you for the nine ninety nine. It, it really means a lot. Back again for another Banuka month stream. Crush those relics and tokens. I like how Bandicoot month has just synonymously become June and July now. Oh, Crash is dead. Crash is fucking dead. Oh no. And Tiny wants to kill him again by the looks of things. Oh, uh, oh so okay, these are the crystal ones, I forgot. I sh I probably should have picked a it's character with a better turning circle, shouldn't I? Oh god. Oh, this is already a good start. Whoa. These are just speed boosts, aren't they? Yeah. Okay. If I remember correctly, these are a lot easier than um, the PS1 ones. The, the timings are a, a lot less strict and you can kind of just lounge around. And you've got speed boosts, obviously. I say as I fail the first one. Let's see. Let's just see. Let's see how we get on. I haven't really got a strategy, so... If I can get through this on my first try without a strategy, then that means that these were really, really easy. That was really bad, wasn't it? Okay, wait. It's Cash Thank you so much for the support, everybody. It's Cash Banuka. Oh. <laughs> okay, right. I think I'm gonna do it, which is funny because I genuinely had no plan. I'm just driving around and picking up what I can see. Oh. Oh, maybe I'm not going to do it, actually. Ten seconds. Can I get the last one? Wherever the hell it is. Oh, it's there. There we go. One second to go. That was close. Jesus. Um, We have Mikey Malone with two pounds. Guess what? Towers, Alton Towers, Alton Towers. Thank you. Thank you for hyping up Alton Towers to nobody in particular. I love Alton Towers. Obi-Wan, thank you for the £10. Hi, Caddy. Just went to Comic-Con and met Boba Fett. His autographs were 95 a pop. I only went for one. Jesus, man. Look, people have to make their money somehow. And also, if you went up there saying, hello, my username online is Obi-Wan Kenobi, he probably charged you more knowing that you're a Star Wars fan that would pay anything. Was he nice, though? I haven't heard anything about um, Boba Fett. You're talking about Boba Fett as in the... Is it the OG Boba Fett from the original trilogy, or is it the new one? The New Zealand guy? Um, I'm not sure. How many purple tokens do I have? The one. So, that's fun, isn't it? Um, Ulcer Dog, thank you for the five pounds. Good evening, Caddy and family. Missed the first part of this run, so happy to catch this one. Good luck getting the Platinums. Happy Bandicoot Month, New Game Plus. That is what it should be called. Actually, no, it shouldn't be called that. It should just be Bandicoot Month. Just forever. Because that's all it is. Let's be real. Bandicoot Month, just, it's all-encompassing. It's all around us, everywhere, all at once, you know. Um, Quirky Frog, thanks for becoming a member. And um, Ola Case, one, two, three, lol. Thank you for the 10 Mexican dollars. That's really, really kind. You only paid 20 quid for Tire Strong to sign your Twilight Sparkle. It Look, people charging for autographs and pictures, it depends on how much work they get and if that's what they need to do to offset the costs of travel and hotels. Shit's expensive. It's really expensive. So um, I'll never, I will, I will never do it personally because I'm not, I don't want to do that. But like, I'm never gonna begrudge people for doing that. I people... think I'd have to pay people to give them my autograph. Yeah, yeah. 
Annie, should we do the cunk challenge? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. In a C -N -K oh, God, there he is. The letters C, N, and K are hidden on. In a C, N, K challenge, you will find C, N, K around the race. You'll know when you find a C, N, or K because you will see the C, the N, or the K. That's why this is a C, N, K challenge. Look at his mouth. It's Casper. Whose mouth? Cortex. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, um, Cider Schizo for the four ninety nine. Bandicoot month forever. It is forever. And all time. And when the world dies in a blazing inferno of an exploding sun, Bandicoot Month is will be eternal. Um okay, so that's where the sea is. I just saw that. <laughs> that was crash. Oh, I saw the end. Behind the ramp. Okay, right. Now the question is, where's the K? I'm gonna guess is on that that route at it's the top, Casper at the Luka. very back. I reckon it's up the ramp here. Yes, it is. And I jumped over it. <laughs> well, I couldn't really help that exactly, could I? Okay, let's see if I can... Okay, I got it. Got the C. Damn it. Oh no. Okay, right. And I've got. I know. Okay, there we go. At least, okay, I can catch myself up now. That's fine. Is there much point doing a frenzy now? Is, is Are the rest of the people going to get affected by it? I don't know. It's Cash Banuka! Got it. Okay, right. So now I just need to make it to the end. Well, and win, but you know, that's 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 not that's not important. We don't need to mention that bit. Okay, I swear the AI is getting. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo! Nice boy. That was great. Oh yeah, the racist pie. The racist part. Out of my way! Oh no! Not on the last lap! Are you kidding? Cash Now that's what I'm talking about. That was really close. Jeez, man. Good. Ooh. We have five five dollars from Shadow Dragon Axe. Thank you so much. I'm in for a 16 to 18 hours overtime shift. What? What do you do for a living? But your stream will help pass some of the times and have a great night, Kelly and family. Well, I would say have a great night, but have a tolerable night. Jeez, man. What was the longest shift you ever did at Waitrose, honey? The longest? Yeah. Um, About the cunk, by the way. <laughs> well, I don't know. Because um, I was only part-time anyway. So. Yeah, but I didn't know if you'd taken up, like... Um, a shift that you like shouldn't have taken Christmas up. Christmas and stuff. When you stay late. Um, oh, I don't know. It wouldn't have been anything more than like eight or ten hours. It's pretty standard. But for yeah. me, that was overtime. sixteen to eighteen hour over. Jesus, yeah, man. Sucks. And is that, that is what. One shift. I don't know. That's that what it sounds like. I'm not sure. Oh. <laughs> it's been know. a while since I've done a trad job, so I'm not sure. <laughs> Kaney Mikey, thank you for the five pounds. Crash Bandicoot Team Rumble would be called you Cash Banuka 20 Rainbows. Token. Yeah, it would be. Or would it? Actually, I would call it um, Cash... Isn't it just Crash Team Rumble? I'd call it Cash Teat Ripples. Oh. Yeah. That's Crash Team Rumble. Cash it's Teat Cash Ripples. Teat. Yeah. Teat. I hate it. Snap Dragon. Thank you for the £1.99. <laughs> Um, ah, yes, CNK, one of the first games I ever played. Um, yeah, it's um, not one of the first I ever played. Maybe on PS2, I think, but I'm not sure. Kitsu Kitsune, thank you for becoming a member. Hendrik Motorsports fan, thank you for the $5 super chat. I see your egghead of a son is in this game. I guess he's still infected with <laughs> seeing a doctor. Like yes, he is. He very much is. What's wrong with it? Here She's comes my really son. Sweet, like... Are you complaining that a lolly is too... Issues with the, with is it the Skittles? Lolly? Oh. Because there's Skittles in the middle. No, it's like yogurt. 
It's like yogurt. It tastes oh. like yogurt. You've got Skittles yogurt in a Skittles lolly. No, it's a lolly. Do you not like it? You don't have to eat it if you don't like I'm surprised it. they didn't have the regular Skittles fruits lollies and they only had berry and sour flavoured. That was interesting. Why didn't they do it like, how, like um, fruit pastels? I don't know. Because these are like ice cream. Like, okay, like, please like, tell me. Like, um, I bet you a million quid, guys. I bet you the C's up there. I hate that jump. That jump sucks. Right. I need to find these letters. I can't find them. I haven't seen one of them yet. Very well hidden. Is there one up here? Okay, all right. There we go. N. Yes, you do need to move your car. Yes. So where's the K? Oh, is it? Wait, I think I know where the K is. Thank you so much for the support, everybody. I don't know how the hell you're supposed to... What was that, it's man? Oh, support after support after support. Thank you so much, everybody. I wish I could support you back, even if you're not doing anything. Thank you, everybody. Very kind of you. I think I know where the K is, so I'm just going to go for that straight away. Sorry, what? She doesn't, she doesn't need to move her car. <clears throat> oh no, so no one's stolen my car. You're fine. Okay, I don't know where the K is or the C. This is this is going really badly. Okay, there's the C. Okay, right. Now I just need to grab the K. Oh, don't you love it when you're driving faster than a missile that you fired? Maybe it's down here. Are you able to turn it up on the telly or would that ruin? Where is it? Where the fuck's the K? I mean, I've lost the race anyway, but like, where's the K? The N is the the N was just up there, so. Wow. <laughs> Unbelievable, man. Should I grab the K and come last place anyway? Yeah, yeah let's do it. Pride, hey, man, I'm Grudge and I got the cook, but I lost. Yeah, is it going to be a Uh, I think I can turn it up a little bit. It just seems a bit quiet for me. It is a bit quiet it's because I don't want to echo. Where? Okay, guys, you, everyone supported at once and I need to try and keep up. Greg93, thank you for the five pounds. Um... Hi, Caddy. Alternate reality where even though my fiance is now... Wait, what? Hi, Caddy. Alternate reality. You're you're here even though my fiance is now backpedal. Oh, yeah, because of yesterday. <laughs> Random question. Have you ever played the Total War games? No, I haven't. Not my kind of thing. I'm not into strategy, really. Shadow Dragon Axe, thank you so much for the $5. I am a school custodian. We're having a drum corps come in and sleep the night and use the school for a bit. Oh, my God, man. You're braver than me. Um, 199 from Snapdragon Gaming Cash Nutella Crabs. <laughs> See, why does everyone have the nice names and I have? I'm, I'm, I'm always gross. Why did you not? Ju no, no, do you know what? I'm gonna. I, I, I swear to God, I'm gonna figure out how to get this jump. How about Crash's nice knockers? <laughs> Crash's nice knockers. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there we go. That is such a specific jump, man. I think you've got to, like, hit the jump as you are leaving it. Oh, yeah, you're my teammate, so that means you can win. Okay, let's get all of the letters on the first lap and then just focus on winning the race. Okay, there we go. Don't jump, just grab the N. N for notepad. Okay, I think I know how to make that jump work more or less every time, I say. <laughs> He's very rude, did you say? Yeah. I mean, he is in a race, honey. 
So what? So instead of saying move or lose it, you should be like, you can win, it's fine. <laughs> like that's his. That's. Oh. <laughs> Feel free to take away, take over. It's cash banuka. Overtake me. It's it's all right. I'm just here for the fun. <laughs> Ted Lasso! Crunch Lasso. <laughs> uh, okay. Come on, bloody missile, man. You can't trust a missile nowadays, can you? Just can't get, can't get a good missile today in, in today's economy, can you? A missile. A missile. Mistletoe. <laughs> Yay! I got the kunk. Hey. Oh, okay. Obi Wan says with five pounds, Boba was kind. The original guy is sadly no longer around. It was. Oh, okay. So yeah, like, I uh, yeah again like it prob it's probably just part of the gig for them. That's fine. Yeah. Mikey Angelo, thank you for the two pounds. Why was CTR called that if there was no team racing? That's a very good question. I would say because it's... That's a very good question. Because it's the crash team inside our hearts. No, because it's like the team, like they're all from it. Yeah. But then that's like calling it Mario Team Kart. It's Cash Banuka! No, have I. Uh, Oh, thanks for ruining our lives. <laughs> Hendrick Motorsports fan, thank you for the two dollars. Crap, cash Niagara Klutz. <laughs> Telly two, thanks for the two pound super chat. Cash Nacho Kit. <laughs> That's a good one. Um, CSDX, hey dude, how you doing? Thanks for the five dollars. Hey, it's my birthday. Hey, happy birthday, man. But I had a rough day at my new job due to asthma. Long story. Glad you're streaming. I need to pick me up. Oh, so sorry to hear that. Happy birthday to you. You share your birthday with our cat. You share our birthday with our cat. That's <laughs> yeah, my, that might birthday. be why that might be why you have asthma because you're, you're allergic to her hair. And she was like, "Hey, it's my birthday. I'm going to shake and give me my hair to everybody across the pond." I think you this okay, she ignore me. Yeah. But yeah, happy birthday, dude. Um, and I hope that the asthma calms down. Uh, Hendrick Motorsports fan, thank you for the two dollars. Clash Noodle Kryptonite. Well, oh, no, that's a bit. That's a bit too far there. That's a bit too far there. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> I think that's my favorite. <laughs> well, an oxide going. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is it species? Actually, no. Oxide wouldn't do that. He'd go. Who is it? It's oxide. His species. <laughs> Who? Yeah, no, no, Velo is the moon in the hub. You're right. I noticed that on the last part, and I've never noticed that before. Which begs the question, how is he the moon? Does that mean that he controls the night? What? P-I-S-S, did he just say? Oh, my favorite, piss. It's piss bandicoot. Darn you, you infernal marsupial! You destroyed my piss gun! My piss ray! I wanted to piss all over the planet! Okay, where the hell is the rest of them? Thanks for giving me a useless item at sixth place. It's Cash Did he just say you look like you're failing? Did Aku Aku just tell me that I was losing? You're, you look you know, like you're sucking, man. Oh, you you know yeah, I know. Oh, there it is. Okay. Okay, I've got I've got them all. I've got them all. It's fine. It's cash I like how he says that, and instead of helping, he just is like, yeah, you look like you're doing bad. That's bad news for you, isn't it? Okay. Oh no! Okay. Guess who? It's Coco, isn't it? <laughs> oh, <that was> fun. <laughs> 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 How am I supposed to catch up? This is ridiculous! I keep getting overtaken! I actually can't physically catch up! This is ridiculous! Oh, 
I, I, I have, I've been boosting the whole way. I haven't crashed. I've been boosting everywhere. I guess Aku Aku was right. Can I bring it back? Can I BIB it? It's Cash Manuka! Oh, I missed. Come on, fourth place is right there. Come on. No! Shit. Just drifted the wrong direction. Oh, he took my power. Better watch your six. <laughs> now you know what that means. Now I know what that means. Oh, I've got a frenzy. Fuck you, man. Excuse me. <sighs> yeah, I gotta redo it. Where are we? We are with Jack Harvey. Two pound super chat. Thank you so much. Love to you and your family. Keep up the good work. Thank you so much. MT, two dollar super chat. Thank you. Cup noodle cart. <laughs> Undead force. Thank you for the nine ninety nine. Um, hey, Caddy, wanted to answer something from the last stream. Some old PAL TVs did support 60 hertz, and in my experience, playing in 60 hertz on a 50 hertz TV on the, will only make the will make the display in black and white. That's weird. Jesus. Obi Wan, thank you for the two pounds. Crash needs knickers. <laughs> does he though? Phoebe said that. Yeah, I think. I, I mean, maybe he does. I don't know. He's got he's got jeans on, hasn't he? I think you. Um, one dollar forty-seven tip from Thomas Jensen. Hey, Kenny, how are you doing? And who is co-host? I can't wait for your new video. By the way, welcome to the ADHD club. Yeah, um, thank you so much. That's a club I'm not very happy about being a part of, but I'm getting it. <laughs> I'm currently having treatment to get out of the club. <laughs> oh, no, you can't leave the club. Oh, just I'm just in it forever, I know. Who is co-host? Keris is. My fiance. Um, Silas Schizo, $1.99. Canned naked carp. Oh my god, we're losing it now, aren't we? We're just getting further and further away from what it actually, what it's supposed to be. David with the long staff. Great name. Thank you for the one dollar twenty-eight. The race is to buy. It's cash Um, what did you say? Oh, we haven't seen Louis as big and long for a while, have we? Okay, right. I don't feel like the speed gains are that impressive with the Aku Aku in this version of the game. I'm not sure. Um, sorry, I'm going to try and read what you're saying. I think that's a gift, I think. But the problem is I can't see what the gift is because it doesn't pop up on my alert. So I'll have to go through the chat and see what happened. I think that's what that is anyway. I could be wrong. Oh, no. I'll just pick it up. I'll be fine. It's fine. Okay, sorry, I'm going to try and read what you said while I'm racing. I can't read it. Sorry, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm getting really distracted. Okay, I'm just going to have to focus on the race. Fucking balls. Okay. Oh! Well, at least Coco's there. Sympathy. My teammate is hanging around in the back with me. Thanks for the useless power-up game. Very kind of you. Make way. The naughty. I was just gonna say. <laughs> no, you weren't. Yes, I was. I can't talk. You can. I used to hate that. Yeah, or make way for naughty. Oh, great. That's exactly what I needed. Oh, 
Ah, oh, thank you, whoever rolled that ball. Did that, did that boost not activate? No wonder I'm losing. The game's cheating. It's letting everyone else boost and not me. Yeah, we did it this time. Woo, where the hell were we? Okay. You had a right. weird noise. What was... Uh... What was that? That it's okay. We had we had a gifted jump. sub by Hendrick Motorsports fan. Thank you so so much, dude. Right, where were we? I was in the middle of reading something, wasn't I? Uh, what's the most what most amount of boosts I've ever gotten? Like twenty. Not not I'm not that good at it. Um, where where are we? Blah, 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 blah. Sorry, I'm I'm losing my position here. Dave with a long star. Thank you. One dollar twenty eight. Hi, Caddy. Currently looking after my girlfriend's dog. Funny story. Last time I was looking after him, I was watching one of your videos. He went mental when Long Dennis was on the screen. <laughs> no, I think everybody would. He probably thought that Long Dennis's arms were like sausages or something. Like, <laughs> gimme. Stuart, thank you for becoming a member. Good try. <laughs> thank you. Well, I tried that time and did it really well. Maybe it was your membership that helped. Thank you. Um, Moon Raven, thank you for the five pounds. Hello, hope you are well. Just wondering what your new, your new intermission music is from. I've heard it somewhere. It's bugging me that I can't remember. It's not from anything. It's Epidemic Sound, which is a stock sound effect and music website, and I use it for my videos all the time. I highly recommend it if you're a professional a editor or something. Um, Tails the Fox, thank you for the one hundred I A E Ds. Thank you so much. Hey guys, thanks for the extended. Thanks for extending our favorite month. Good luck in your recovery. When okay, I've no people have been saying that a lot. When people say good luck on your recovery, is that what that means when you've like been diagnosed with something and then you're being medicated for it or something? I I've never. I, I thought recover. I thought recovery just in involved like you've broken something and you're job. it's fixing. I mean, you are... Recovering oh, from what? Well, the shock. I mean, I've just never heard. I've just never heard it talked about with mental health like that. Well, you are recovering in a way. You're finding your way through yeah. something. Mm, I guess. I mean, yeah, you're not I guess. gonna get rid of it, but you are gonna manage it. So, mm. yeah, I've never really thought about it. Anyway, sorry, I'm getting, I'm getting. When I was young, CNK was my favorite crash racing game because CTR computers were racing on the same line, and it was dub. <laughs> I love anti gravity and stages design. Yeah, the, the the tracks are really good in this game. I'll give them that. <laughs> it's just the 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 actual driving mechanics aren't as good as CTR. That's why Nitro Field is the best way to do it. Um, Tiger Tales TV, thank you for the two pound super chat. I found a couple of quid in the sofa. Th fancy them? Well, you've already given them to me, so yeah, I'll take them. And also, how did you get them in the sofa into the computer and then send them to me on a super chat on YouTube? How did you do that exactly? Oh, it's Tani. <laughs> Hendrick Motorsports fan again. Thank you so much for the five dollar super chat. Sorry about earlier. Why? What did you do? Did you hurt somebody? Why are you sorry? What's, what, what have I missed? Anyway, Cortex came to my door and that, and slapped me with a pie. I fully deserved it. I have no idea what you're talking about, man, but thank you so much either way. <laughs> right. Ooh, what a rat. What thing? It's Cash Manuka! What? He's had a pie. No, you're racing and it's not like the same pie. Oh, wait! No, uh, I have no idea. No, I'm no, lost. I'm sorry. I'm lost. Also, there's 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 lots of different worlds. Where's the other world? I've lost I've lost it. There's only there's only a certain amount of do Oh it, wait, do I have to go to the other world through another gate in here? Oh gee, why is it so confusing? Um, DK Vest Boy, thank you for the 17 Donkey Kongs. So kind of you. I can do the 50 boosts here. Beefy, you're right. Ah, you used a glitch to unlock Vila? I didn't know there was a glitch. Edgar Allan Ho. <laughs> Thanks for becoming a member. <laughs> wait, you unlock the doors by going up to them? So in the story mode... Wait, 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 wait. No. Wait a second. Are we having a pivot? Also, you can't reverse into these gates. Look at that. But if I turn around... This is a weird game. I ha but, but you start... Going, what? I'm. Mm. 
So in the story mode, you just get transported to the levels without the, the keys opening the doors. And yet it keeps telling you that the game is saving and yet it's not saving at all and you have to save it manually. Like, this is, this is a weird game. What the fuck, man? Okay. I would never have ever thought to do that. Should we try and get the 50 boosts? And then we can unlock Pura? Oh. No, you can't do the 50 boosts here. Oh, wait. Okay, you can if you get the boost at the very last possible second. Yeah, if you wait until it's like top touching the top of the boost gauge. Well, this is actually kind of difficult. I'm waiting for it it's to all go wrong. Right, if I can excuse myself. Uh, yeah, it depends what you're excusing yourself with. Yeah, go to the loo. Oh. Alright, I'll leave you with Phoebe, though. Hey, my faves. No. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I've done 50, so that means I've technically unlocked a character, right? Shall I keep going? What happens if I get, like, 100? I can keep going. I'll see what the clock does. Like, I don't know if it will, like, tick over or if the game expected me to do any more than 100. Okay, 63. Right. Right. So now what? Did I get, did I get the character? I mean, this is the story mode, I guess, but... Does it not count? It stops at 99. Okay, but yeah, did that count though? It only counts during a race? Oh my god. Save the game. Also a good shout. I'm going to do that right now. It, uh, you have to do it. You have to do 69. I have no idea what... I have no idea, guys. It doesn't matter. It's not part of the adventure 100%, so I don't mind. $10 from Spider. Thank you so much. Oh yeah. <laughs> Bitch, better have my money. Pimp Daddy Caddy. Thank you so much. Right. Let's go to Burin. Ah. I mean, yeah, but it would tell you, um, it would tell you if it was available. Like it would pop up on the screen and say, "Yeah, look, I don't care." Yeah, it's during a race. Okay, fair enough. Okay, I don't know. Uh, whatever. Do I not stream on Twitch anymore? Um, well, look at where we are. Kind of answered the question. No, I don't stream on Twitch anymore. Alright, so, so far this is going 40, 45 minutes into the stream. We're doing alright. Yeah, I'm not interested in trying to get 50 boosts on one of the races to unlock one character. I, all I'm doing for these Bandicoot Month streams and going through them chronologically and 100%ing them is just 100%ing the adventure modes. I don't need to do every single thing. A king. Thank you for the four ninety nine. Well, if you're a king, you could afford a bit more, can't you? Thank you so much for the four ninety nine. Very kind of you. Hi, Kelly. Glad to see you're streaming. Had an incredibly fun day at summer camp watching first graders in 90 degree weather. Now I have a migraine. Every single part of that sentence sounds like hell. Um, I'm so, I feel so sorry for you. And also, I'm, I'm assuming I know what you're talking about. Like, I guess you're looking after kids at the, at this camp or whatever it was and not just being there because you like being <laughs> at camps in 90 degree weather I don't know I'm just going to assume it's innocent and not question anymore woo okay okay no oh hello okay there's the N N for necktie Okay. Now, is that... Oh, there it is. Oh. Good. <laughs> you weren't on the track enough, even though you absolutely were. But you weren't where we wanted you to be. And that's the most important dis distinction. It's Cash Vanuka. Whee! Okay, I've got all the things. So now we can... Oh, no! I was trying to do... I TNT... Oh, no, I didn't. Okay, that's fine. Better watch your 
Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Around and about. Okay, I don't know why that hurricane didn't affect me, but I'm not about to complain. Whoa. Yeah, the missiles in this game suck ass. I hate them. Could I get 50 boosts in this race? Every possibility I will. Let's see if I can. Be funny, wouldn't it? And I wasn't even trying. Ah, I should have used the boost that I have right now. Yeah, should have panicked and used that. That's a fun race. I like that one. Edgar Allan Ho, Canadian 20. Thank you so, so, so much. It's been some time since I've been here. Take 20 Canadian because you are caddy. Well, that's a good enough reason to get 20, I suppose. Things have been tough lately. I lost my job and such, and I, but I just started a relationship. And with her, Bloodborne and you, I'm still happy. Dude, that's... It sucks that you lost your job, but I'm, I'm really, really happy to hear that you're happy. Really happy to hear that. Because ultimately, that's all that matters. It doesn't matter what you end up doing or, like, wh where you end up in life or who you end up with or, like, what impact you leave on the world. The most important thing is that you are happy. Because ultimately, like, we'll all turn to dust one day anyway, so, like... Don't worry too much about leaving a legacy or anything. Just make sure that while you're on this planet that you're happy and do whatever you need to do to make yourself happy. Unless that involves hurting other people or being racist. In which case, don't do that. I'd rather you be sad if that's the case. Wonderful. You... <laughs> what? <laughs> Wonderful. <laughs> you... Was that the start of that song? You... Wonderful. You... Bastard. Oh, Twyla, hey. I just didn't see you there, Twyla. How's it going? I am looking after you with life advice. You're very important. You! What's that song? Thank it's you! Soldier Boy, that's it, yeah. Five pounds from Daniel Dorian. Evening, Kelly, my dude, from Northern Ireland. Third stream I managed to catch live. Awesome! Nice to see you. Um... Seen Guns N' Roses in Glasgow at the front barriers thought of you. Okay, that's cool. I've heard that Axl Rose is a bit of a state right now. Is that true? Also, why did you think of me with Guns N' Roses? Just out of interest. I will say, as, as a classic rock slash hard rock, well, someone that grew up with that kind of music, I, I, am, I don't like Guns N' Roses that much. They've got a couple of good songs, but as far as a band goes, like, I don't know. I'm going to do a very, very Don't know if I'm opening a can of worms there. Welcome to the jungle, sick. Um, oh, damn it. Oh, damn it, no. Okay. Okay, so somehow the game wants you to go. <laughs> That's another shortcut there. Uh, Guns N' Roses was ass, to be honest. I feel like they're a band that just kind of keep. They keep alive based on the fact that people know what they look like rather than, like, what the song. How good the music is or how great they are as a band unit or anything, you know? I feel like they were they were mostly about image more than anything else, but that's just my opinion. Okay. Make way! I've got one more chance to get this C. And I'm also really, really far behind. I don't know how I'm supposed to do this exactly, but I'll give it a go. I'll, I'll try and B.I.B. it. 
Seems to be going well so far. Okay, I did it. Nice. That was really lucky as well. Really lucky. Come on, I just need to get rid of engine. Okay, missile, great. God, that was lucky, man. This might be the luckiest race I've ever done. Oh, <laughs> perfect, man. Good. Ooh. God, man. Um, what was I? I was gonna do something, and I've completely forgotten what it was I was gonna do. Um, first of all, um, leave you asleep. Could you, do you mind getting me some Pepsi Max, please? Thank you so much. Yes, please. What was I going to do? I was going to do something. Going to read something? Was I? I bibbed it. I did, Twyla. Yeah, this, so this is the problem. This is the, the, See, it's like I should have known I had ADHD all this time. I just forget things. No, I don't remember. Steven Adler does Axel's vocals better than Axel himself. But yeah, maybe I was talking about Guns N' Roses. I don't know. I don't remember what I was talking about. Yeah, I always I always thought as a band, even when they're at their height, I don't know, p pompous, um, over over blo overloaded, bloated, over overproduced. It was yeah, I don't know. I I can't really explain it. But that doesn't mean they didn't have some good tracks. Well yeah, Welcome to the Jungle, You Could Be Mine. There's some there are some really good tracks, but Sweet Child of Mine is overplayed to fuck. I hate that song. I'm sorry, I hate it. I don't like it. And I used and I, I used to be in a band where that would be our encore. Um when we played in at uh, different live gigs and stuff. Because it's a very, very easy crowd pleaser, but I got so sick of that. So sick of that um riff. I'm playing. Mary, I am playing on a modded PS2 Slim. Which might explain why the loading times are all right. All right, deep sea driving. Oh, I missed Frozen Frenzy as well. Oh, wait, no, don't want that one. Okay, deep sea driving. Here we go. It's Cash Banuka. Whoa, hang on a sec. Two euro 49. Happy to catch another Banuka Bounds stream. It is a, it is Bounds, isn't it? It's Cash Banuka. Do I have any more hot takes? <laughs> oh my god. What have I missed? Anything? Um, no, I was just saying how Guns and Roses aren't that great. Oh right. Yeah. Um, two pounds from Premium um, Catus. Thank you so much. Sending love from York. You should visit. Um, have I been to York? I don't know. I'm just uh, have we ever done it? I'm, I can't really remember. I don't think I've been to Yorkshire, but not York itself. Mm. Yeah, Keris is here. Twyla's Twyla's perked up in the chat. Keris is here. Yeah, okay, I saw the sea straight away. <laughs> it was by the beach. Uh okay, deep sea driving might be good to try and get those boosts in. But trying to keep that boost going in that boost tunnel is very difficult. Oh my god. Oh, it's a it's a shortcut. Oh, okay. It's well, you know what? This is what the these races exist for that. Because then, A, it helps you when you want to play the game in multiplayer. And B, when it comes to the relic races. Uh, what did he say? Oh, there's the K. I just saw the K. Ah. Yeah, it helps you know more about where the shortcuts are and where the other boxes could potentially be hiding. Oh god! Ah! I'm gonna try and hit that shortcut just to see how easy it is. 
Down here? No, it's not. It's not. Wrong way. Wrong way. It was... Here? There it is. Okay. Right, and then the K is up here somewhere, I'm pretty sure. There it is. Oh, that's a horrible noise. Oh, I got hit by the scissors. He's got metal on his arm, honey. Is he? Yes. Because he can turn his um, arm into a, a big carving knife. Really? And cut steak. Geronimo! I'm making it up, honey. I don't know. I... You said really. <laughs> I'm just super <laughs> you. Are you? Oh, thanks, Crash, for pushing me into the scissors. Okay. Now that's what I'm talking about. What? Driving? <laughs> well done, Crunch. <laughs> Oh my god, I can't do the level in the video game. Ugh. Okay. What a rush! What a rash. It's hey. This is going really well. Where are we now? Zach Bowman, thank you for the $20. Hey, Caddy, I've been watching your content for years now. Thank you for the last. Although it's July, let Cash Banuka watch over us. He watches over when you're sleeping, when you're awake, and when you're in the ground. You can't escape Cash Banuka. Oh, we have some gifted members. Hey, thank you so much. Swordless Warrior, thank you so much for the gifted um subs. They're not subs. Members, thank you so much. Look, there you go. Gifted for the gifted members, you can have a big cunk. How about that? Um, we have Lacey H with five dollars. Thank you so much. What's up, Caddy? Um, the sky. Cash Naughty Crack is my favorite crash game. Interesting. I've never heard anyone say that. I'm still laughing about Velo's pimple moon joke from the last stream. Oh god, yeah. I'm glad other people remember it because I just say things and then move on with my life. I'm glad other people kind of take note. Klaus, hey dude, how's it going? Thank you for the 20 Mexican. Crunch's profile picture looks better in Europe. I've heard. Apparently that's a, it looks really awful in the American version. I don't know what that's about. And I don't know why they changed it. Because I, th oh yeah, because I thought it was 9-11 related, didn't I? Um, Premium Caters, thank you for the two pounds. Or go to Wrexham. It'll make your day worse. <laughs> uh, how, okay, have we... That sounds familiar. Have we done Wrexham before? I don't know. For any reason? I, oh. I recognise that word. I, mean, you might have gone. I don't think I have. I one think I've been to Wrexham for you some reason. A token. Oh. Congratulations, you've won a tutu. You, <laughs> you've won a tootle. <laughs> you've won a big fat trumpet. I'd like that for a tutu. Okay, let's go beginner Coco. Because I'm a baby. That is a horrible picture. I'm doing good, Arctic Fox. How are you? Look at that. Oh, that's... Yeah, Ryan Reynolds. Yeah. That's where I've heard it before. What, Rexham? Yeah, because he owns the football club. Does he? Oh, yeah. And the guy from Always Sunny. Oh. They did a... They did a um, it's, I, it's, it's either on Netflix or Apple TV, but there's a big documentary thing about it. Apparently, um, according to Wally, it's really good. It's worth a watch. I'm 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 interested to watch it because it's I follow them both on Twitter and it's really weird to see American people talking about football. It's really weird. Did you know how much you talk about football? No, I'm just saying it's weird. <laughs> it's weird seeing the guy from It's Always Sunny talking about the boys. You know, it's just weird. Yeah, this is this is a good idea going with Coco. The turning is a lot better. You haven't got the speed, but that doesn't matter. Aside from now, when I need to go fast. Okay. Ring, ring, do 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 do, ring. Where's the last one? Oh, ow! The corner of a slope. The corner of a slope. 
So if I drive around, I'll eventually see it. Oh, yeah. These are way easier than Crash Team Racing. I will say that. Way easier. Where are we? Um, $3.34. Thank you so much. Um, steamed hams and knuckles. Hey, Caddy. Good luck with the plats. Thank you so much. I haven't even started them yet. I've added your previous crash streams into a playlist and gone back to rewatch them all. I'm up to your Crash 4 stream. It's inspired me to play the game again to completion. Am I batshit crazy? Thanks for all the content. You're not crazy. No, you're just Ow. very, very naive. Dude. Daniel That's Dorian, good. thank you for the five pounds. I thought of you at the gig just because I know you love your classic <laughs> rock. Wasn't sure if you like the band or not, lol. <laughs> I mean, Wonderful. even if I did like Guns N' Roses, like... Oh, is Phoebe going to bed? Starting line, oh, your boost game will appear. Dead. Press the gas button to fill <laughs> the gauge. Are you if telling me how to boost? The the <laughs> I hate you. He's John 84. Late, yeah, sorry. I, I got distracted there. Sorry. I'll get to you in a second, John 84. I'm sorry. Um, Yeah, okay. Have I done everything here? Yeah, I have. So now it's... Oh, Phenomena. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, if even if I even if I was a fan of Guns N' Roses, I don't think I'd like what they've become now anyway. Like, oh, oh from uh, from what I've seen from live footage and how Axel's been, and like the fact that even Axel is playing with Slash again is weird. Like last thing I heard, they all hated each other. Axel was a big fat crybaby. <laughs> that like if someone like said, "Hey, hey, dude, you you got a pimple," he would just quit the gig and ru run away. Like. I heard I've heard some stories about Axl Rose, so I'm just I'm I'm amazed that he's playing with them again. You know what have I done? Oh, you can go from world to world. That's weird. Okay, I didn't know that. Okay, all right. Can I can I jump to the next world from here? Oh, that's tech. That's Techni. Okay. I guess it doesn't matter. Just fucking go to Techni. I'm already here. Screw it. Yeah, I've I've um. Yeah, I don't know. Axel always came across as a prick. It's not that he's a prick or comes across as a prick. There's just something very prosthetic about Guns N' Roses, something very fake. And so even when they were even when they were good and they they sounded clean and they could they could perform and they had the look and everything, but now they're just they're just washed up old drugs. Like I don't know. I, I just I'm, I'm, I just don't don't feel anything with them it's anymore. Yeah. Anyway, John eighty four two fifty seven. Thank you so much. Uh, Kunk challenge, thank you. Hi, Caddy. Thanks again. Heard about your diagnosis. I myself have become sure I have ADHD over the last few years, and now I'm trying to get a doctor's appointment to confirm it. It would explain so much. Best wishes from Brighton. Ah, oh, I want to go to Brighton so badly. I know, we should go this. Yeah, summer. we sh absolutely. Where's I want. I do want to go. I I love how I love the look of Brighton. I love the like the music culture behind it, the history about it. Levelers are from Brighton. If you didn't know that. Where is yeah. it? Mm. Brighton's at the bottom. Yeah, and apparently the, it's just really nice. Yeah. And Nick Cave used to live. I don't know if he still lives there, but he used to live there. Um, Glenn, hey, dude. Thanks for the two euro super chat. Parzifal, thank you for being a four month member. Oh, can I read your Aku Aku quip while I'm racing? Let's see if I can. In order to race, you need to press the accelerator to move forward. It really do be like that. Better watch your sex. You better have sex. I that. Oh, did you? Booyah! Like <laughs> booyah? Why did Crash say booyah? I don't think he says woe in this game, now that I think about it. That's a cardinal sin. You shouldn't do that. Okay, so... Where are the... Okay, there's the K. I missed it. Okay, well done me. So if that's the K, that means I've missed the other letters. I, I saw the C, so I don't know where the N is just yet. Whispering isn't going to help, Ames. Can, people can still hear you. Oh. Oh, I'm glad you're laughing at it. God almighty. Oh, uh, oh, start again. Just go. Turn around. <laughs> Turn, around. <laughs> Turn around, sister. <laughs> oh, my God, girlfriend. You need to turn around. <laughs> oh, I'm starting the race again. I can't be fucked. Oh. Oh. The nice. Thank you for five, uh, five euros. Oh, are you nice? Or is it 
Um, the, oh, the Nyes. Wait a minute. N-I-S-E. Nice. Okay, do you know what? I'm going to keep retrying until I get this, this shortcut because otherwise I'm going to do the whole race and try on the second lap and miss it, try on the third lap and miss it, and then I've got to start the race again anyway. So I'm going to try and get it on the first lap. Fuck off! Okay, let's try that again. Raccoon Peddler, thanks for becoming a member. Well, Moon Cycle. If anyone wants their day ruined, um, look up the lyrics to Moon Cycle by Melanie Martinez. Me and Mum are going to have to listen to it. Yeah, I was going to say, you did have a choice. You bought the tickets for the show. And, she, and for some reason, she does, for some reason she doesn't have an age rating on that particular part of the concert. <laughs> I mean, I guess there's not much point, but still. I mean, if you're an override, you can build up a concert, but I'm not. Oh, how the hell do you get that K? I, I swear to God, I just keep hearing dirt coming out of these people's mouths. I swear to God, he just said, what, you can't keep it up? <laughs> like he's humiliating you. Oh, shit. Okay, that was a disaster. Oh, that was close. Ideally, I want to try and get a boost. Bomb is fine, I guess. I have absolutely... I can't, though, Ames, because I can't turn tight enough. Okay, I need I need to I need to basically get lucky on this lap then. So that that other shortcut isn't a problem anymore. I can I can reliably hit that one. No. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. Probably going to be a boost in here. Okay, I'm gonna. I don't. I, I don't know, guys. Wait a minute. I'm just gonna have to. I'm just gonna have to get really lucky. No, it's cash Banuka. I don't know how to get that K. That sucks, man. That absolutely sucks. Without a boost, and even with the boost, I don't know how I'm supposed to, like, angle the car or anything. Okay, I've got a boost. I'll just save it for that bit. Like, I really can't be asked to figure out the, the intricacies of trying to hit that jump. The thing is, I've, got, I've now got time to um, line my car up with that part of the level and then just hit boost and then hope for the best. Like, it doesn't matter if I stop, because I can just... So now I can be like... Uh huh? How do you get it? You can't jump high enough. What the fuck, man? Are you getting cross? Yeah, I'm getting cross! I can tell. <laughs> Kieran Williams, thank you for the five pounds. Yo, my dude, congrats on the diagnosis. Pretty sure I have ADHD alongside autism, reinforced by the fact that I uh, minorly flooded my bathroom. I mean, that... Yeah, I mean... You know what? If I flooded my bathroom, I'd think I was autistic as well. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? It's funny, though. Go backwards. Let's try. 
Interesting. I mean, I've got the K. Thank you for the the idea. I would never have thought to do that, but okay. I was thinking of, like, it should be possible to do it forward because my guess is that in the time trial, there's going to be a time crate where that K is. So I was trying to figure out a way to hit it going forward because in the time trial, you're not going to have time to turn around and go backwards. You'll, you'll waste too much time, but I've got it now. doesn't matter. Thank you for the little suggestion there. Oh, that was an accident, and I'm, I'm, I'm still on the race, and I'm in the track, and I'm gonna, I'm, 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 winning, I'm winning now. I'm nibbling the winner. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at that! I nibbled the ringer, the, the wing. The, the, oh my god! See, that's one of the reasons why I thought I had ADHD. I trip over my words, and all the time. And the reason I trip over my words is not because I have a stammer or anything. It's because when I'm speaking. There's three or four alternate words or sentences that are trying to come out of my mouth all at once. They're all like fighting in a little cramped doorway trying to fit through, you know? Well, yeah, you don't because you don't have what I have. But that was that was one of the things that made us question, oh, hang on, maybe I've got a problem, you know? But no, I, I was going to say you were talking about the autism thing. So what's interesting is that when I, was, when I went through the whole doctor process, the first thing they had to try and figure out was... Was it one thing or the other? Because apparently they are... The, the symptoms are very similar, but there's a few key, major key differences. Which changes how you approach the whole process of trying to fix the problem or cope with it or treat it or whatever, however you want to describe it. So it's very important within the first, like, session or two that they distinguish if it's an ADHD thing or an autism thing. And I was on the... Aut uh, no, the... <laughs> See, this is the problem. I'm on the ADHD thing. ADHD? Yeah. Attention doesn't have da dinner. Attention doesn't have doo doo. There you go. Doo doo feces. Where are we? Um, steamed hams and knuckles. Thank you so much for the 334. Very. Vincent, my sisters call my autism the tism. <laughs> That's... <laughs> Uh, thank you so much. Um, on the subject of going back and rewatching old streams, insert joke about your vehicle going over a jump print sounding like engine. <laughs> Absolutely. Original trilogy streams are some top tier comedy. Oh, thank you. Say good day for the rest of the family for me as well. <gasps> oh, what was that? Well, that was me breathing in was while having a hiccup. hiccup? <laughs> that was a well, big hiccup. Has... Wonderful. Wonderful. You... you lost. Where are we? Okay. I got uh, Android Alley and Elect. We're gonna run down to Electron Avenue. Bah, bah, bah. What? What did you say, Annie? <laughs> Yo, the racist pie. <laughs> In this game's defense, the voice clips are way clearer than on the GBA version. The GBA version, when Cortex says the race is mine, it's, it, it, I'm just spitting ice everywhere. It sounds you exactly... You are such a squelchy eater. Tiny knock you up. <laughs> Yeah, it sounds like it sounds like that on the G bit with the bit crushing, but on this at least it's. But yeah, I can't unhear that either way. Why has Nakuaku got such a pointy nose? You hang your washing on it. You can hang a tent up with it. Maybe he is a tent. Why would you hang a tent? The fucking hell did you just say, Tiny? <laughs> Were you in the middle of eating something? Tiny That made perfect sense, Tiny. It's almost like you're a oaf of an animal that should actually be talking. Tiny is the like he's got it's the Scooby-Doo effect where it's like 
they have tried desperately to teach an animal that shouldn't talk to talk and it and it just can't do it and it tries so hard. Oh, there's the C. I missed it. Okay, I'm going to say that the shortcut absolutely has one of the letters in it. I don't know which one, but it definitely does. N. Okay, great. So where's the K? Oh, okay. I really messed that up. Okay, it's fine. Second chance. I think I can get them on the second lap. Thank you for the support, by the way, everybody. I'll get to you when I have a second and I'm not shitting myself on a racing game. Oh, no. Ah... Uh -huh. Ha! Ha ha ha! What a rush! What a rush! Do you say no, he says, "What a rush, honey." Rash Bandicoot. Are you very embarrassed about it? Okay, I think the C was here. Yeah, and I somehow missed it. I have no idea what that was. I hit jump, but okay. If you say so, video game, then I can't argue with video game. Oh! Dude, I crashed into the wall and yet nudged myself onto the wall I crashed into. That was right poggers, in it. What? That was so poggers. What does that mean? Play, it mean uh, pog is, is P-O-G, means play of the game. So when, pe yeah, so when people say that, that was Pog, it means, oh, that was amazing. It is, it is an app, yeah. It's proper Poggers, especially when English people say it. You've never heard that before. That surprises me. Why? Because it's everywhere. On Twitch, anyway, it is. People used to say it all the time. Yeah, in my chat they did, yeah. Okay, come on, get the C, get the C, get the C. Waste of time, man. Has Cortex found the racist pie says Parzival with two pounds? Um, I think, well, every time he says it, he, he mentions it. So I think he sees it or he thinks about it. He has fond, mem he found fond memories of the racist pie. I think they're, they're old school friends or something. They're school chums. How does my sauce taste? He says that. I'm sorry. He does not say, how does my exhaust taste? That's probably even worse. Yeah, it is. Actually. Yeah, because that means you've got to put your mouth over it. So, okay. The reason that I couldn't grab it that first time was because the where, the, where the, um, the speed boost is placed, it has a slight bump in it. Oh, perfect. Look at that. It has a slight bump in it, which means that the car is technically, as it's going up the ramp, it's technically still in midair as it's going up the ramp. So you can't then hit jump. Oh, whoopsie. You can't then hit jump. It's the same problem that you had that I had with the GBA games when you're running down a slope and Crash is like, fall he's going so quick that he's falling down the slope. So he's already in midair, which means he can't jump because he's already in midair going down the slope. So same logic applies there. Next time we go over that speed boost, you'll see it in action. Like Crunch will kind of bump as he, like he kind of jolts as he goes up the ramp. And if you jump during that jolt, then you're not going to jump. And then you'll just do what I did on the last attempt of trying to grab. Look, watch. Just there. See? I didn't, I didn't jump there. That was just the game deciding, oh, you went over a bump and you went over a speed bump. Oh. And you went into a... Oh, Crash likes it. <laughs> he said that more than anything else in this damn game. He's very excited. He's doing a System of a Down song. <laughs> the racist pie. Hey, racist pie. Hey. <laughs> bandicoot, bandicoot. 
Racist bandicoot, racist, racist bike. Do we all learn defeat from Crash with his feet? Oh my god! What are you guys whispering about? Oh yeah. Poor Olivia. One of Amy's friends earlier today um, was helping her brother move a 20 kilo weight. I'm trying to think what that is in pounds for Americans. Uh, 20... Uh, hey Siri, what's 20 kilograms in pounds? Okay, um, 44 pounds. So one of Amy's friends was moving a 44 pound slash 20 kilo weight. Um while her brother was working out on his 18th birthday, because, you know, birthday workout, I guess. Fun time. Mm -hmm. And she dropped it on her foot. She dropped a 44-pound weight on her foot. Yeah. And definitely broke a lot of it. But the pictures we sent, the bruising, like, oh, my God. It was like no, she... it's gotten worse. I, I know, it would get worse. Yeah, she dropped it. Yeah. Ouchie. <laughs> uh, where are we? Um... Ale Mew, I think that says, thank you for the $5 super chat. All of these people talking about having autism or ADHD, and then there's me who has both. Oh, dude, unlucky. Uh, yeah, that must be that must be a struggle. Now, now I I know I know part of the struggle. Now I can relate at least on that on that um, front. But yeah, that's the, it's interesting. Yeah, like they they try to distinguish. Like I don't I think that's a rare case as well because the um the doctor I was I've been seeing had told me like it's either it's usually only one or the other and they just need to try and figure out by specific questions and talking about it's my past and all the all of that stuff they have to try and figure out which one it is. But if you have both, man, that's a, that's a rare case. One a token. One ninety nine from Snapdragon Gaming. Thank you so much. Why does Tony sound like the heavy from TF two? He probably is the same voice actor. Because I don't think Brandon O'Brien was doing the voice at this point. I could be wrong about that. I think he stopped at Wrath of Cortex. I have no idea. Um, and five Australian from Rusty Destroyer. Thank you so much. Yo, Cad, are you perhaps doing a video including Crash Team Rumble? Oh, poor people. All, all the people that don't know and are asking. No, I'm not. I'm not playing Crash Team Rumble. I'm not interested in Crash Team Rumble. I'm not making a statement. I'm not making a stand i'm not trying to get people to not play it i don't care I, it's just not my thing it's just not my thing just because crashes in it doesn't mean i want to give it a try it's the kind of game that it is is so not my thing that a video or a stream about it would be an insult to the developers because anything that i don't like about it would be because i just don't like those kinds of games and that's not the developer's fault so i don't want to okay. it's a like a battle royale like It's like, I think it's like you you all share the same kind of, it's like, think about like a, a mini game in Crash Bash where you're all kind of on the same board. I don't want to think about that. Okay, well, I'm trying to describe what the game's like. Um, and it's like, you have to try and win the game with the most amount of Wumper Fruit. I guess it's kind of like Splatoon. I, I don't, I don't, I don't really know to be perfectly honest. That's the thing. I, I, I know n next to nothing about it because I'm just that uninterested. So yeah, I don't want to contribute to a a negative aura surrounding the game, if there is one. I don't even know. I'm not even looking into what the communities on Twitter are talking about or anything. But I don't want to contribute nothing to it. How the hell are you supposed to get that in? Interesting. Thank you. <laughs> oh, no. It's, it's actually kind of it's kind of related to the same reason why I don't review stuff anymore because it's like I just don't see what I what I what I critique quote unquote or what I talk about holds weight when it's not I, I never claimed to be a professional person that knows what he's talking about to begin with that's why I just want to focus on trying to make people laugh now that's fine the K was there and when people start holding your opinions to some sort of pedestal or high standard or like, oh, well, like, the reason I don't like it is because 
Caddy said that. It's like, well, no, I don't want to be used as the example for that because I'm not. This isn't. It, it's not my job. It's something I fell into, you know. And I fell into it not because I'm a good journalist, you know. Yeah. Are you gonna play Crash Team Rumble? <laughs> nah. People can keep on asking. Like, not not everybody's gonna know, are they? So it's fine. There is a certain somebody we know that would get really upset, wouldn't they? I won't do the voice because you'll know exactly who I'm doing. I've told you guys a thousand times. Is no one listening? You buffoons. It's because I'm not doing the voice. You don't know who I'm talking about. I've already explained this in the chat, you dense plebeian. You dunce. Oh, okay. Don't, don't worry about it. Yes, it is, yeah. Personally. I'm sure people in the chat can figure it out. Ned! No, you yeah, you know, I, I think a couple of people in chat might get it. Is it a real person? Yes, yeah. And then you don't look people. Can't even have the character. Oh, well, I mean, he, he is a character. And dude! <laughs> no! <laughs> It, this person is a streamer who explains something one single time and then gets really upset when oh. somebody asks the same question like the next day because oh. they expect... What? Banned? What did you say, honey? Banned. Banned? I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> But yeah, like they, they, they answer a question one time yeah. and then another person will ask like later on in the stream because they just got there. Like yeah, what's... They ban oh, ban? I thought you meant like music band. Oh yeah, 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 you're right. Yeah, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Then, yeah. It's just so funny when they're like, oh my God, you dense basement dweller how could you not understand what i just said yeah. didn't i already just explain it yeah, yeah but some people just got there man like chill out yeah. can i make it oh it doesn't matter if i do because he's my teammate okay that's okay Whee! my sister <laughs> You know what, premium caters, I don't know if you know who I'm talking about, but that is exactly how they talk. So you've, you've got it pretty much on the money. Um, ben Lasky, thank you for the 4.99. I've got both as well. ADHD stands for Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder. See, it's weird though, because the reason I never considered me having ADHD before is because when you break it down like that, Attention Deficit Hyperactivity, like that's not how I feel. I don't feel hyperactive. And I don't feel like my attention is like, I can't, because I can watch films. I can sit, like, I'm, my attention is doing this. I don't have to constantly, you know, I, I don't know. It's just something I never considered because you always think when you're younger, oh, ADHD is like you're bouncing off all the walls and screaming and telling everybody that you're going to shoot them, you know? And, uh, and that's not what ADHD is, clearly. It's a, it's a lot deeper and more complex than that. Uh, Parzifal, thank you for the five pounds. I have Asperger's syndrome, diagnosed when I was six. Oh man, wow. What's so? What's the difference between Asperger's and um? No, I don't know. I don't know. I, don't, keep looking at me. I, I keep looking know. at you because I don't know if you've got I an don't answer. Know any of the answers I'm not looking at you because it's like, oh, you know better than I'm just no, looking. I don't. You know no. more than me you about this stuff. Token. Oh, I well, laughed. It's more than the memory thing. There's. The reason that I decided to start looking into it is because I was talking with a friend of mine who thinks they have it, but they know someone who definitely does have it. And they were like, hey, so we I was talking to my friend who definitely does have it. And um, one thing led to another. And then I started going off down this list of like why they figured out they had it. And they were like, well, when I when well, I was going through this and I felt like this and I felt like this and it's I felt like this and then this person started talking to me and said, well, do you experience this? Do you experience this and this and this? And I was like, yep, 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 yep. I think I have ADHD. Like every checkbox, every single one, you know. Um, 
difference between autism and Asperger's. Uh, <laughs> the difference between autism and Asperger's is that Chris Chan will hate you if you have the latter. Is that true? Oh my god, is that true? I mean, if even if it's not true, it's believable. Oh my god. Oh, Asperger's is an outdated term. So is that just what we call autism now? I'm not sure. Um, Katie Abbe, I think that says. Thank you so much for 4.99. I'm super stoked to catch your stream. Live long and floppy. <laughs> what? Always. <laughs> Always. <laughs> I'm super stoked that you're here, Katie. Thank you so much. Oh look, Cortex is doing the the um dickhead Luigi meme from Mario Kart. Have you ever seen that? No. Like the evil Luigi. Yeah, it's so funny. Okay, let's get all of these crystals. Oh, to really whoops. To the, um, oh, fuck. I don't know, the kind of... Conversation. Yeah, is my issues with... Your sensory stuff. My sensory yeah. stuff. Yeah. Other than that, it's kind of... You know more than I do, but... Yeah, Keris has a thing... <laughs> Keris has a thing with textures. Like... Like if textures aren't exactly how she likes them in any like it's mostly mostly in bed to be honest, and I, I li literally mean being in a bed. Um, but yeah, if there's <laughs> if there's really bad. what in a bed, <laughs> can't make it any clearer than that. It's like kids TV show level. Um, anyway, yeah, like there's there's situations where you're like you struggle to like relax or rest. You'll retch at certain textures. You won't be able to relax with certain textures. Um, you'll get you get itchy and irritable with certain textures. Um, yeah, there's a, there's a load of things. Sensory dysfunction disorder. Somebody says in the chat. Oh, S SPD. You saw, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, sorry to turn the subject. I'm just gonna say this is like I have run into four nitro crates and I've still got a minute and fifteen seconds to go and four crystals to find. This oh, is. Did I do that? And it's and it's like a circle. Like this is just it, this is just a tiny little arena. This is almost insulting. Like why are we even doing this? This actually feels like a waste of time. Maybe it is. <laughs> Sucks are! Sucks what? What? What did she say? Suck what? S suck! I have no idea. <laughs> Sucks are. <laughs> What? Pixar, more like sucks are. Am I right, guys? Put it on the thumbnail with a big red arrow <laughs> and Mr. Beast pointing with his mouth open on it. <laughs> um, Stout Shaco, or Shaco, thank you for being a two month May member. Maber, I was going to say. I forgot that I had this, but I might as well Wonderful. say it. You could have you ADD, which is just ADHD, talk. but without the hyperactivity. I have ADD myself. I have been told by a professional I have ADHD. We've, I've gone through all the correct avenues and everything. Within the, I had an hour and a half consultation, and within the first 20 minutes, um, she basically said, just so that, just to put your mind at ease, just in case you're wondering, I am 100% convinced that you absolutely have ADHD. So. Yeah, that was, and that was from an ADHD doctor. That wasn't like a random GP or that was someone I paid to see them. You know, that was a private thing in a private healthcare facility. And I got a referral from another doctor because the thing that the, the thing with private healthcare in the UK, it's weird because um, like, wait a minute, what, where am I? Okay, so I need to go to, oh, Phenomena, yeah. Um, yeah, it's, it's interesting because like, um, yeah, stout. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, it's um, cause it's it's weird. I've been, I like oh, I don't even know where to start. It's like um, in the UK, if you if you're unaware, you can basically just ring up and book an appointment to see a GP, which is a general practitioner, just your average doctor. If you're feeling sick or you think there's something wrong, and then you get an appointment and go and see them, and then there's either something wrong with you, and then they take it further, or there isn't anything wrong with you, and then you don't miss out on anything. You don't pay for it. Um. But the problem is, when I told the doc, because they, they ask you on the phone, what is it that you think is wrong? Um, the receptionist has to give you a, a, a rough idea, you know? Um, just so that they can direct you to the correct places. And um, 
make sure you get the right treatment. So they ask you just like they're like, it's a privacy concern, but they do have to ask you. And then once they ask you, it's Cash Banuka. Where's Fenomena? Is that Fenomena? Is that it there? Oh, there it is. Yeah. Um, and then yeah. So then once I said I pretty sh I I'm like I'm very very sure I have ADHD. The second that they know understand what avenue to send you down, they then throw you on a waiting list for something like that because that's you need specialist treatment. The problem is though, for free healthcare being as amazing as it is, when there's a specialist problem, um, they eventually basically, and this was after like weeks of waiting and weeks of me talking with another doctor and me filling out forms and everything. Basically uh, like a month and a half or two months later, we then get a phone call saying, okay, the waiting list for ADHD diagnosis was at like, what, two years did they say? It was something like two years on the NHS, which is like, okay, it's free, but it's a long waiting list. And I just couldn't, my heart sank. And I was like, now that I'm aware that I might have this, I want, I want to get my brain comfortable and knowing that I'm, I'm sorting it out, you know? So str like, so straight away, I was like, okay, I need to figure out how to do this. But the problem is, is that no private healthcare places anywhere, at least where I looked, will touch you for that kind of treatment because it's a very, the meds are very strong and they're very dangerous and very addictive. So they have to make sure that they are 100% certain that everything, everything has to be done by the book, basically. And in order for you to do that, you need to see a GP to give you a referral. But it's the problem is the GP Manuka. appointments for ADHD were two year wait. So I had to pay for a private GP appointment somewhere that's an hour and a half away just so I could get a bit of paper. It's what am I doing? Manuka. Why am I playing as Coco? I'm sorry, I'm not paying attention. Just we're having a nice sort of community therapy yes, session. Yes, we are. And you're getting distracted. I am getting distracted, yeah. Which is part of what you're dealing with. Um. So yeah, yeah, essentially that's what happened i had to go to a random doctor pay for that appointment just so that i could get a bit of paper and that was after they decided if i if they need I, it's not like you can just go in and say hey i need a bit of paper that says i have it they have to make a judgment based on how you are during the appointment filled out more forms that was about a, what an hour appointment 45 minute hour appointment mm -hmm. that then they gave me a load of forms signed officially by doctors and everything and then i had to go back to the private health care and be like hey so i think i have this and i also have proof from medical professionals that i this is something that i can pursue and then then i met the adhd doctor and here we are now i haven't tried any meds yet um or anything like that and i'm yeah that's where i am so yeah that was my journey and it took a long time to reach that point and there's not there's not really any places where you can just google in the uk how to get seen quicker or anything like that because it's it's more complicated than that there's different levels and different layers and different people you have to see in different orders so there's not one easy for all fix solution which is really strange but once you if you're desperate enough you'll you'll research and figure it out yourself which is basically what happened with me hey junus how you doing if that's how you say your name, sorry if that's not how you say your name. I think now that I'm the reading it out loud. Pie. The racist pie. Oh, the flat bandicoot. Yeah. <laughs> uh, nearly one in the morning, I think. It is a weekend. Okay, I'm pretty sure there's some stuff here. Yeah, there's the sea. Nice one. <laughs> Who's made a smell? It was me, you, and everyone else. <laughs> no, it wasn't me. Yes. If, look, if it stinks, it's the dog. No, I can't. Oh dear. It smells like compost. Yeah, and who eats the grass? No, but Stan eats it whenever we go anywhere. He's always walking around with grass blades hanging out of his mouth, isn't he? Bloody stupid animal. Mutt. Yeah, I can smell it now. Oh, that's very earthy, isn't it? Thank you for the support, everybody. I will read it in a second, I promise. Did you just try and throw a bowling ball at me, Coco? Thank you. Oh no, I hit the corner! Can you smell it? 
Oh my god, what a disaster. So disgusting. <laughs> so disgusting. It's like he's in the middle of swallowing something. We yes, we did. Well, a, a temporary. The thing. Well, the thing is, honey, like if which I'm pretty sure you do, but like let's say that you do have it, like you don't feel the need to get diagnosed because you're like it's not ruining your life. Whereas. Which is, yeah. It's not dangerous, so... Yeah, so it's almost like, yeah, you don't... So you're just happy to try little homegrown yeah. solutions. Yeah. Oh my god, what the hell happened there? Better luck next time. And there you go. Better luck next time. Can I do this? I doubt it, but it might be possible. No, it's not possible. No way. No way. No. Fifth place. That's the worst. Oh, my God. And I was trying. I got eighth place, like, earlier, but that's because I deliberately came last. Anyway, where were we? Um... Ben Lasky. Sorry, I was ranting about shit, wasn't I? Um, 9.99. Thank you so much for that super chat. Asperger's syndrome has been rolled into the autism spectrum disorder. Also, people with ADHD can hyperfocus, so it's understandable that you cannot feel like you have it. Well, I mean, yeah, that's the thing. If you have it and it's deep rooted in your brain, then you just think that that's normal. And that's why I never thought about having it checked out before. And now in hindsight, it's like after having all these interviews and discussions and filling out all these forms, it's like Oh my god, my brain was supposed to feel like a completely different way. So even though I've lived this long, I've, I've lived like 30 years having this problem, and I've never thought about it as a problem before, and it hasn't been ruining my life, quote unquote, that's only because I just figured that's what life was, you know? But now I've been told that like that's not how it's supposed to be. And now I'm... How did I not get that C? And now there's a, like, there's a, a way to help look after that or treat it or nurse it or whatever. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm starting again. Absolutely awful. Yeah, sorry, yeah, sorry. It's not, uh, yeah, I'm sorry to tell you, you have blah, 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 And then you're just stuck with it, yeah. Here's what you can do. It's just weird. It's just weird to sound like because it's like, oh yeah, like it's not, like the, this sensory thing isn't ruining your day-to-day -day life. So it's, but it's like it wasn't this whatever this is. It wasn't ruining my day-to-day -day life either. But that's because I'm I'm just I was just used to it and I just figured oh that's just kind of what what it is you know that that's what life is. But then when you're told oh no wait you're not supposed to really feel like that and here's something that you can take or therapy you can have to make you feel this way, which is how you probably should really be feeling then that's when it starts really affecting your day-to-day -day life because then you're extra aware of all the little things that you do and think and feel and behave which is like I shouldn't be I shouldn't I shouldn't be thinking like this why do I think like this like oh that oh that's why I struggle with this and I don't need to struggle with it anymore there's a solution there's an out you know I would say it's the same, like the same with a phobia is my guess. Yeah, I don't know. It's like exposure and have, going over and like playing with those baby books with all the rough patches. <laughs> sorry, I will read the support, everybody. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm getting very distracted. This is part of my problem. Most exciting thing for me, though, is the fact that I'll be able to balance my work a little bit better and hopefully get videos done more efficiently and... And be able to relax. And all Karis needed was a seven kilo blanket sitting on top of the. Thank you for the support, everybody. I'm so sorry I'm not reading shit. I'm kind of preoccupied. 
I'm sorry. How am I missing every single letter? Like, I can't. I'm not jumping. So what do you want me to do? I'm going too high and I'm not even jumping. Anyway, where are we? I'm going to read everything right now because this is silly. Um, Craig <laughs> oh. Hawkins, thank you for the two pounds. Why the loading screens look like AI art? Oh, God. You, you, now that you've said that. Alex Shearman, 10 pounds. Thank you so much. Hi, Caddy. As someone who also has got autism and ADHD. That seems, okay, maybe it's more common than the doctor yeah, made it. Um, thank you for talking about it and normalizing it. I can it, I can fall into the trap of feeling broken and wrong, so it's nice to know I'm not alone. Oh, no, oh, no, no don't worry. Dude, don't worry about it. Like, this is why whenever people joke about, like, autism or whatever, like, who... Like, who it, the, the more it's just a silly little thing, the more people just... It doesn't. It doesn't necessarily have to be dehumanizing, but people can make light of it and just talk about it like it's a normal thing. I'm not looking for sympathy or anything. It's just I've got this far. I've got a million subs out of it's having it. You, you know, are, it's just part right? of me. You know, and I'm and I'm yeah. not happy now that I'm aware that it's a part of me, and I'm just trying to fix it. You know, but yeah, people can joke about it and everything. It's no. It's no big deal. Um, Five dollars from Retro Josh Station. I think that says. Um, glad I got catch one of these live. Have fun with the relics, Caddy. I haven't even got to them yet. I'll be working, but I hope you have an easier time with Jungle Boogie Woogie. Oh, I'm not looking forward to it. Um, RW, you. thank you for the 22. Thank you for the support, everybody. I'm trying to get through this as quick as possible. 22, 22. Thank you so much. Hello, Mr. Caddy. Um, uh, nice to see you are spending some quality time with your cunk. Also, can you please ask your son to stop making scary faces? He terrifies me. Oh, yeah. Engine. No. Entrance does do that. I'm sorry. I'll make sure to ground him for the week. Celine person, man. Thank you for the $10. I'm an ADHD diagnosis too. It's an interesting squad. I just hate the whole getting started uh, on it all. It's good that you're getting on track for the diagnosis and treatment. Sounds like you went through heck. I See, in comparison to other people, I didn't. I was just desperate and enough and lucky enough to have some money aside where I could treat myself quicker. Um, yeah, so... Yeah, I was just lucky. Is, is the only way I can say it. And another two dollars after that, I meant recent diagnosis. Oh, I see. Thank you so much. Um, Ed Stringer, ten Canadian. Thank you so much. Got back from a vacation. First place had decent Wi-Fi. Can't say anything about the other two. YouTube is being picky. My caddy streams caught in a row have been reset to one. Ed, I'm disappointed. You should come home from holiday this instant. And make sure you watch every stream. Greg, thank you for the five pounds. I was recently diagnosed. No, sorry, you weren't recently because that was when you were two years old. I was <laughs> diagnosed with Asperger's when I was two. I used to hate it, now, but now that I'm an actor, having it is has its advantages while doing a show. Interesting you say that because I think what you'll find is that ever since I came forward or like told everybody online that, oh yeah, this is a thing that I, I think I have. And this is now something I definitely have been diagnosed with having. It's a common thread that loads of people on YouTube, or at least loads of people in these kinds of industries, whether it be crea well, creative industries, that we have some form of it. I think it's because our brains are wired in a certain way to deal with the pressures or the workload or the weirdness or the... Oh my... God. I am not happy missing all these fucking... I'm just going over them or going under them, and I don't know why. Um, yeah, our brains are wired in a certain way to be able to deal with it and like deal with negative comments and shit because it may be like, I don't know. I, I'm not it's saying it in a bad way or a good way. No, I'm no, 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 no. <laughs> no, what I'm saying is that it's a common thread that some of the biggest YouTubers or some like at least loads of my YouTube, YouTube friends seem to have some form of that kind of problem and mo the most common I've noticed is ADHD because, and, and I don't think it's a coincidence that like people that specifically make YouTube videos and have to fight the algorithm and shit oh my god no 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 I'm turning around yeah this is and th and all this time when I've been talking about oh sorry everybody this is why I'm, I'm terrible at multitasking I can't play a game and talk to chat and read shit and do everything at the same time, that's part of the reason. Coming at you, baby. Why are you flying over the K? Now that's what, I'm talking about. what, missing the letter? <laughs> Make way. I think I need to hit that ramp slower. On this lap, I'll try and hit it slower and see what happens. Hmm. 
God damn. Is that coke? Oh no, it's oxide in front. Great. Why does he look like a leaf? He does look like a leaf, doesn't he? What is he meant to be? He's just an alien. If I okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna commit. If I don't get it on this lap, I'm gonna be very upset. Oh, these missiles suck. It's my own trap, and I've fallen down the hole. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. I don't think I'm going to do it. Even if I win the race, I don't. Okay, this is good. This is good. Oh no, this is the one thing I didn't need. How? I can't really do this any other way. I, uh, if I jump, I jump over it. And if I go over it normally, I go over it normally. Ah! Where the hell are we? I'm sorry. Um, Team Cortex says Joel Oxala. I think that says with five euros. Thank you so much. Ben Lasky, thank you for the 499. Final message. Can we call you Mr. Dickerous as your dad name, lol, instead of Daddy Caddy? You can call me whatever you want. <laughs> uh, Geordie Bridges, thank you for the $5. Thank you so much. Got a copy of The Amazing World of Cat Icarus. Um, sending you love and Yorkshire tea. Aww. Oh, oh, you mean the, the collectible world. Thank, thank you so, so, so much. I know that wasn't cheap. Also, sending you love and Yorkshire tea. So I'm assuming you're... Oh, no, no, you sent $5. So you're not British. Unless you are and you sent American money. <laughs> Aloft Meliva, thank you so much for the two dollars. Love to you as an autistic fan of nine years. Oh, thank you so much. Ed Stringer, thank you for the Canadian five. I am back from vacation. That was what I was saying. Oh, I see. But you missed my stream, so it doesn't matter, does it? You didn't come back. You didn't come back early enough. This level is not that difficult. I know exactly where the letters are. I just keep missing them. They're not difficult to get near. I'm just not clipping them, which is really annoying. I was hoping to get, like, at least... You know the deal, Ames? If this is... Yeah, if you're going to complain about this, then we'll make you go to bed early. I know. I'm just letting you know. I'm just I'm saying. I'm oh my god, I hate this rat! First of all, thank you for the five pounds. People with these kinds of conditions tend to be creative types. Yeah, I think there's a reason. You're all nuts. I'm just gonna kill. Do you know what? If I don't get all of these on the first lap, I'm restarting the race because there's no guarantee I'll get it on any of the other laps. So I'm gonna get them all on the first lap, or I'm just gonna keep restarting. There's just there's no point going through two or three laps only to miss one of the letters on the final lap. It just doesn't make any sense. I'm going to get them all on the first lap. So I, I named the stream. Oh no, I did say I was getting the tokens in the stream title. I was going to say, no relics in this stream. What hit me? Oh, I just haven't done any... Um. Oh my god! Okay, there we go. Thank you! Thank you for letting me get it, Ted Lasso! <laughs> okay, how the fucking Christ am I supposed to get this K? I hate this race. I hate this race it's with a burning passion. I'm going back. I'm going back. I can't be bothered. No. It's easier for me to catch up to the front again. I'm going slowly! Come on, Kay! Oh no, I'm going too slow, apparently! I'm sorry, guys. What is this bullshit? 
<laughs> if I go over without jumping, I can't get it. If I go over jumping, I can't get it. If I go over it slowly and jump, I can't get it. If I go over it slowly and not jump, I just go over it like a speed bump. What do I do? Thank you for the 50 Donkey Kongs, Yoshi Poyo. What's your favorite racing track in Crash Team Racing? It's not this one. Um, also, I hope you're doing well. Lots of love from a banana. Thank you so, so, so much. Jumping off sooner. I tried. I tried. <laughs> uh, Max, thank you for the $2. I'd love if they made a brand new CTR sequel. That would be pretty fun. Um, a Fasul Ox. Thank you for becoming a member. What I don't understand is that I got it first time when I first did this race. I just lost it and came fifth. So I don't understand why I'm struggling so much to get this K. You call that racing? This is racing. What, crashing into me? Yeah, he did sound like Johnny Rotten. <laughs> like when he was younger. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want a holiday in the sun. Oh my! <laughs> Oh, no, you're sounding... <laughs> what does that mean? Can you do that? No, I'm not doing it again. I'm not your performing monkey. No, I'm not. I do not remember when I met when I went into making this the video series. No, no, Ames. When I was making the, the video series about getting the platinum relics, I do not remember this being so fucking annoying. I just don't. Got it. Nice. Got a nice C. I got a nice cramp. <laughs> Alright, this is the next difficult one. Got it. That was exactly what I was trying to do the whole time. No needing to turn around or anything. Right. Hit the yes, fucking yes. corner. Of course I did. Okay. Let's get the goddamn K. Watch me get the K. Watch this. I'm going to do it. Watch this. Yeah, boy! I got it! I got the special K! <laughs> now I can start my day with all the energy that I need, thanks to Kellogg's special K. Oh, no. Well, now I'm flat, so that doesn't help, does it? Uh, now I just gotta win the race. I just gotta win the race. Oh, I didn't know the tornado could um break boxes for you. That's pretty cool. Oh my god. This, I swear to Christ, this was not as frustrating as this when I last did this. Time to rock and roll, baby. Yeah, you're in last place, Crunch. Shut up. <laughs> Why did I put a trap there? No other racer takes that shortcut. Why did I take... Come on, come on, dude. Yes. Okay, I'm just gonna shut the fuck up and win. Oh no, why did I do that? Why did I do that? That was a mistake, that was a mistake. I shouldn't have done that. It's I didn't hold it. I swear to God, I just pressed jump. I swear. I swear, man. I swear. Come on, hit this shortcut. Hit the shortcut. Yes, yes. Okay, this is good. Don't hit the trap. Don't hit the trap. Don't hit the corner. Dictionary. Come on. Excellent. That sucked, man. And I suck. We both sucked. And what happens when you get two sucks together? Get you get. Yeah. 
Thank you, Ed Stringer, for the 50 Canadian. Dude, you didn't need to do that. Thank you. You see that letter, you won't get it. Approach it fast, you miss. Approach it slow, you miss. Approach it while jumping, you miss. Approach it while not jumping, you miss. Approach it crooked, you miss. Approach it not crooked, you miss. Well, Ed Stringer, fuck you. Bottom. I just did it, all right? And because I'm good. Well, I'm not, but, you know, I just did it. Thank it's you for the Kasper donation. Though. Yoshi Poyo, thank you for the 20 Donkey Kongs. It's a bit easy to get the K with Coco. Yeah, I suppose I could have just used someone else. I forget that you can change characters. I always think, because in Crash Team Racing, you can't change characters, so I always think I'm stuck with Crunch. Maxis Anime, thank you for the $5 super chat. Tonight's episode of Caddy Nitro Crap is brought to you by Kellogg's Special K, because the others slept through the church. Oh my god. Ulster Dog, thank you for the two pounds. First try. Good. It was first try, wasn't it? I only took one attempt. I did so well. Two hours. Like, I was hoping to at least start the goddamn Platinum Relics tonight. But, yeah, no, that's not happening. Absolutely not happening. Oh, God. I bet you on out of time. I bet you on that track, one of the letters is going to be over that fence shortcut, which is a bastard to hit properly. Oh, dear. Well, let's, well, let's see. Let's just see. We'll see what happens. Wonderful. You... <laughs> Wonderful. You! Okay. Oh, let's go again. Yeah, we do get more Bandicoot Month streams. That is very true. I think we're, I think we're probably going to be done in like... Based on how long it's taken me to get this far with just the regular CTR... C, no, CNK races, the, the token races... But then there's no other races. Like with with the with the token races, you have to get the tokens and come first, which is already kind of challenging on itself. But at least with the time trials, you just have to worry about hitting the boxes. So it I might it might be quick. And also I don't remember fully. Oh, there's the C. I saw it. I don't remember fully um how um. Got it. Nice one. First go. Um, right, so now I just need to remember to go on that right ramp at the beginning of the race for the C. Ooh, what a rush. It's Cash Manuka. Where's the K? What was I saying before I got distracted? It's Cash Manuka. Thank you for the support, everybody. Yeah, so that was what I was trying to say. I don't remember how generous the time um, limits are. for, Because in Crash Team Racing, they are pretty damn strict. I thought the K was there. I can see the K now. It's over there. They have an asshole place to put it. This, like, there's no way you can just naturally grab that while racing normally. You have to put yourself in the sand. Come at you, baby. Okay, right. Hit that. Grab it. Got it. Okay, right. Now I just got to come first. Easier said than done. I'm aware. Can I hit this shortcut? I need to stop trying. I need to... It's such a difficult shortcut to hit. And I bet you now, I'm not going to come first in this race. And then I've got to do the race again. And then I'm going to have... The clockwork Womper problem where I can never ever hit that shortcut again and I will never hit that letter. Or if I do manage to hit the shortcut, I won't be able to hit the letter. Did I just... I just... So engine got slowed down and trapped by an ice cube that I placed. I think that was my one. And instead of him slowing down, I just rammed into him and pushed him along. Oh my god. I jumped over the missile, dude. That was sick. That was like John Wick. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. 
No, no, no. Not on the final turns. Absolutely refuse that notion. Oh man, that was so close. Good. It's Cash Manuka. Oh my god. 20 Donkey Kongs from Yoshi Poyo. Thank you so much. It's not your good lol. I'm wasting money. Oh dude, thank thank you. You re you you really don't need to spend the money, but thank you. I, I appreciate it. 10 pounds. My god. What is what do I do to deserve this, guys? Thank you. Thanks, Caddy. That's Alex Shearman, by the way. Thank you for the 10 pounds. Thanks, Caddy. I guess it's more to do with how my relatives would talk negatively about it, which I then internalize as something to feel bad about. Anyway, I'll shut up now. Why are you sh why are you shutting up? I think this is part of the problem, Alex. You need to you need to unwind. Like you you you've already knocked yourself down, but you've explained yourself, and now you're knocking it's yourself down. Manuka. Don't do that. You don't need to shut up. Like what? what you're, you're making it sound like I you annoyed me. You 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 didn't say or do anything. My whole life, like p the things that now are being used for me for ADHD, every everything that's been listed off as a check mark from my childhood and everything, I got bullied for it. My family would make fun of me for it, or I wouldn't be involved with things for it. So yeah, I know the feeling, but you know what matters is right now. You know. Wonderful. Yoshi Poyo, thank you, you for the twenty Donkey token. Kongs. Okay, last one. I swear, I just want to support you. I really, really appreciate it. And three hundred isks from Assman. Thank you so much. Yeah, people are cruel and that will never change. So there's no, there is absolutely no point doing the whole anti-bullying campaign shit. It, 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 <laughs> if you've been a parent or anything even vaguely similar, you know that that is, it's falling on deaf ears. It's absolutely falling on deaf ears. Okay, right. All it's doing is encouraging the bullies because it knows that they, they know that it's working. And ultimately, what can a campaign do against... Like, if, you're tell if you tell a bully what you're doing is wrong and this is why it's wrong, then they're just going to be like, oh, whoa, oh, I, what? I, oh, that's wrong? Like, of course they know it's fucking wrong. That's why they're doing it, you know? Reminds me of this thing, um... I've been I've been watching a video series um, from some new channel that I've never heard of before, but it was pop it popped up in my recommended probably because of my ADHD shit that I've been dealing with. Um, but it was a guy talking about narcissistic personality disorder, and they were talking about how the ironic thing about um, NPD specifically, when it's properly diagnosed or you suspect somebody has it, the the prop the problem with NPD is that it can't be treated directly with that person. The only way you can treat that kind of thing is to cut off their their, their narcissistic supply around them. Because the problem is, is, if you tell a narcissistic person, this is what you're doing wrong, this is how it's affecting other people, and this is why you shouldn't, or this is how life could be, most narcissistic people take that as like advice on how to keep doing it. <laughs> or they're like, Oh, God, I didn't realize that I was having that effect. I'm going to do it this way next time, you know? Like, so, the, the yeah, the, 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 that's the ultimate irony with treating um, narcissistic personality disorders that you can't really. It's more about you have to just cut everybody off out around them. And that doesn't mean, oh, it's up to everybody else to treat it. What it means is... Oh, God. Yeah, what it means is that, like, you just have to not engage and then leave them to stew in their own narcissism. Because narcissistic personalities only, they thrive off of the attention out of other people. So once you cut those other people away, but it's difficult to cut other people away because narcissists are very good at making you think that you are that you mean something or that you're important to them, but they're just using you for whatever selfish reason that they want, you know? It's been good vibes. It has been a very self helpy kind of, kind of thing. Based feel, hasn't it? You know? Yeah. I mean, look, that that, that, that was a, from a video series from someone that studies it, but isn't like a qualified doctor. But it was like, I, I, I when they said that, I was like, oh, you know, that, that actually does make sense, you know? What's that? I'm um, talking about um, people with narcissism. Yeah. 
the way you treat it is not by going one on one with them because they're, nar- they're narcissists. So they look yeah. at it as like a like a um, an, an instructional course more than an actual therapy session. And that's if a narcissist even goes to therapy because I, I could imagine most of the time they're just like, I'm too good for therapy, I don't need it. It's quite, <clears throat> quite a miserable existence. It's a miserable existence from everybody else on the outside, but for them it's like, that's what their life is, but they you know? they can't truly be happy. No, but... but that's quite sad. Yeah, it is, but because they're so wrapped up in their own self and the idea of their ego and, you know, their everything else that narcissism comes with, they're so wrapped up in it that no they can't no see it or they they're just they're just completely content with the way things are in their head even if everybody else on the outside is like this is really weird what the hell are you doing or how can you possibly be happy yeah oh so this 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 time limit is a bit tighter, so just need to play it a little bit. I'm also not playing as Coco, which was a mistake, wasn't it? Exactly. <laughs> Although I am get I'm doing a lot better with my timings now. Oh screw, just drive into it. <laughs> Who cares? I don't. I'll drive into the nitro. Do you want to hear something funny? Yeah. <clears throat> Um, I gave Toto, who's one of our guinea pigs, mm-hmm. I had to give him a little bum haircut earlier. A bum haircut? Because he's not a long hair. He's a, he's a cross with something and a long haired breed. So he only gets long hair on his bum. Yeah. Good. And I have to trim it, so otherwise it gets grubby. You do, yeah. It's Cash Manuka! Um, I have given him quite the undercut on his bottom. He looks like he's wearing a dress. <laughs> you wait till you see it. Oh, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> Yoshi Poyo, dude, thank you so much. It's 50 DKs again. Oh my God, dude, thank you. Okay, last one, I swear. I really love how real you are. Very down to earth. We could all use a YouTuber or streamer that is like that. I appreciate it. I don't actively try to do that. That's, I'm just, just doing, just being me. This is just who I am. I appreciate it, though. That's also something that the person we were talking about earlier would say. It's cash You Manuka. guys know I am the realist. No, what for, fi- for, fi- for 15 is, years, I've been real and I've not been fake. What you is, I'm just being true to myself. And all that bollocks. Oh, no, I'm talking about the the person I was talking about oh, earlier. Oh, I no. no. Oh, well, I mean, I they are, but yeah. Like, right, yeah, okay. Oh, what are you going to say? The bowling bomb will detonate either when it hits something or when you press... Did you know that you can use items against other racers? I didn't. Uh, driving like sane people is for suckers, says <laughs> Dead Trigger with two Canadian. Thank you so much. Six dollar ninety from Villa. Funny number. Thanks for being there. Where I don't know, but thanks regardless. Well, then next time I'm there, I'll let you know. <laughs> Did I know my lungs need air? Crash. I am a face. Bye. Oh, you okay? Oh, God, you're just giving me, like, a very concerned look. No, I've just got a sore bit. Oh, I, like how, I like how you haven't tried the whole throwing your bra off thing again. Well, you made me feel really bad about it. Why? So it was funny. I think people yeah. loved it. It was very naughty and suggestive. <laughs> oh, she's done it again. Okay. okay. <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. God, is it really that easy? It's cash hey, can I have boo, please? <laughs> Don't know what incels are talking about. It's so easy. You just ask ask woman for boo, but she gives you boo. <laughs> the doctor is in. <laughs> actually, it was actually that was surprisingly quick. <laughs> like the second I even mentioned it, and then like you are on the money with it. It's like you were prepared. <laughs> Yeah, I know, I, I know. I've said it before. That's taking fire off. 
the end of the day is the best. I think lots of um, lots of women can relate to that. Where the hell are any of these letters? I haven't seen a single one yet. Okay, N. N. For nooks. 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 Yeah. Okay, where is... Hey. Geronimo! Okay. Move it or lose it. The nooks with the silent. So where's the C? Oh, it's there. I see it. Okay, I can get it on the. I can get it on the last lap. <laughs> That's famous last words. Yeah, I will get it on the last lap. You watch. You just wait and watch. Oh god, no, I shouldn't have said that, should I? Uh, Maybe not. No. <laughs> I said okay, 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 YouTube. I promise. <laughs> I'm gonna save this boost for grabbing the C later. It's Cash Banuka! <laughs> Thank you for the support, everybody. Okay. Oh, I thought it was in the air. Okay, no, all right, don't worry about it. Okay, I thought I'd have to do like a speedy jump. Come on, get in front, get in front, get in front. I don't know if that did anything. No, of course he went around it. How is he going so quick? I'm the top speed character. He's got a massive hit. Great. He got hit by a big spiky prick. <laughs> okay. Yeah, baby. Uh, TV's going to turn off again. God, he is playing a rough game here. You will never best me. Oh. I, I just did. Ugh. Okay, that was really, really fucking lucky there. If I didn't have that shield, I would have lost. Woo! My TV's uh, gonna turn off. It is, and I have a bra, if anyone wants one. Uh, I reckon that would fit on your head. <laughs> it probably would. Uh, where are we now? Um... Alex Shearman, five pound super chat. Thank you so much. Next stream, no more crash, no more games. Therapy with Daddy Caddy. I'm down for like I'm a for chatty little, yeah. like grab some coffee and just have a full screen, nice little chat. Right. I mean, I've done that before when the streams have broken or the games have, you know, <laughs> but I'd be too frustrated. But yeah. I could I could do that next time. Maybe when I'm on my meds and I'm a little bit more clear yeah. in my head. I'm just hoping that I'll be able to stream more, get more video work done, not get as easily distracted or wound up in my head about other things or you know it's so hard to describe what my head's like but basically i'm hoping that the meds will just make everything so much more productive and clear i'm clar i'm looking for clarity because i didn't realize until i was told and i was thinking about it that my head Wonderful. is just a big mess you. essentially so lewis harwood thank you for the five pounds hey caddy have you ever experienced burnout when it comes to writing videos love all your streams much love from glasgow hey glasgow um yes i have Especially when I was doing three videos a fucking week. Yeah. Nowadays, I don't because I upload like four or five times a year. So I I take as much time as I need for everything to simmer and everything to develop, I suppose. But in general, yeah. And I think everybody does. Um, and if you are experiencing it, it, then my best advice is stop. Because my the old me would have said, you have to upload three times a week. Otherwise, you're going to be irrelevant. So... I had no choice but to upload three times a week and I just had to throw myself at the wall and that's why so many of my old videos are, have aged terribly, you know? I've got a little bit of time. I want to do something else. Maybe, uh... Hmm. Oh, I'm not sure. I've got all the tokens now. Hmm. 
Maybe I should do the, um... Should I do the, um... The, uh... The champ... The champ... Oh, should I do the gem cups? I can do the gem cups. Because the thing is, I don't have to worry about restarting the races. With the gem cups, I just have to worry about going quick and winning, which I can do pretty easily. Because that's what I did for the last part. Um, and it, oh, I miss A King. I'm so sorry. One dollar ninety nine. Just curious, have you ever visited Bath? Oh, I thought you said, have you ever had a bath? Um, I have visited Bath, and it's really nice there, and also very expensive to live there, as far as I'm aware. Uh, Maxis Animate, thank you for the five dollars. Thunderstruck, brought to you by Badger Blast. Don't like it too bad. We're soaking the entire course of the stuff. <laughs> yeah, it's a very Mountain Dew level, isn't it? Um, Ass Man, thank you for the. 300 isks. I love that. How long have I been streaming for? Does it not say on the stream? It should do somewhere. Right, now the question is, where are the, the, the cups? No, I just threw them at you. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Lul. Lul. Uh, yeah, where are the cups? Are they back in the Citadel? We'll see how long it takes me to do... The first gem cup. And then, depending on that, I'll either do one more cup or all three after that. Because while I'm here, I might as well. Because I, I have a feeling that getting the relics... I want to try and do this all in three sessions. I want to try and do adventure mode on one session, tokens and gems on the other session, and then finishing the game on the final session. I don't really want this to roll over into four sessions. But is that where the question mark is? Find out. Velo's Vault. I want to go in there. Uh, <laughs> oh no, my pop tire. I need the AI. There's something very Phoebe-ish about Coco. Coco isn't there? Especially in Crash 4. Yeah. Hey, here we go. What's the fifth gem for? Oh my god, what are you going to tell a me? A gym cup is a series of races where you're awarded points for each <laughs> race. Thank you so much. I mean, at least I haven't done a cup race before, it's so at least that makes a little bit more sense. Yeah. Uh, Lewis Harwood, thank you for the three pounds. Would you consider doing a video on horror games? Funny you mention that. Yes, I was planning on doing it this year, but realistically with... I'm just... I have to just be honest with myself... With going through the ADHD shit and, like, I'm going to be trialing many different medications. I'm going to be going through multiple different side effects, mixing and matching with medication I already have. It's going to be an interesting year, and I don't think... I wanted to get three more videos done after this one I'm working on, um, including a Halloween special. But I think, realistically, I'm going to have to cancel the Halloween special and work on the two videos that I was going to work on alongside them. I mean, for all you know, when you start with medication, I was invincible. You might be like, be more actually, I can do more videos. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. Well, I've also got, I mean, at the end of August, I'm going to be at Indie PopCon in Indiana. And then immediately after that, basically, I leave the UK on like the 24th of August to go to Indiana. And then I stay in the States, head to LA after that, then head to Seattle, and then head home after PAX, which is like September the 3rd, September the 4th. So I'm spending, that's the longest amount of time I've spent in the States in one go before. And um, yeah, I know it sucks, honey. I, I did, if, 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 if it, we were able to make it work, you know we would have done. Um, but yeah, so like, that's going on in August. So realistically, I won't be able to get much work done in that situation. So. It, yeah, it's a busy year for me. I'm ahead. I'm ahead. And a body. Look out! I'm gaining on you. <laughs> Are you? Don't say that ever again. And he will, just to spite me. It's Cash Banuka. Thank you for the support, everybody! Hey, 
That doesn't even sound like Crash, does it? Crash? Yeah. I thought that was from the other one. <laughs> Sounds like Pingu. <laughs> oh no. Crunch, what are you doing? Come on. Crash Bandinoot. <laughs> Oh, that was a risky move there, but it paid off. Because the lucky... Something else I keep forgetting as well is that there's only... Instead of there being four races per world, there's only three. So... It technically shouldn't take much longer. Oh, I don't know. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh dear. Oh mother. Hey. Let's see if I can get these fifty boosts. It's Cash Manuka. Oh, that was too good to be true, wasn't it? Okay. Okay, I'm not going to risk it with the shortcut. Just need to make sure I get to the end. Hey, nice one. Okay. Canadian $5 from Ed Stringer. Dude, thank you so much. Hope you're not spending too much money, all right? You may have been invincible, but did the train know that? Well, I think it knew it. It just didn't care. Ramen Wolf. Hey, dude, how are you doing? Thank you for the $10. Hey, Caddy, I can't believe I actually caught a stream. Never happens. I was going to say, I know, you from, I know you from Patreon, but I don't know you from the streams. Nice to see you, man. When I saw the Spyro vid, is it weird that I freaked out when you showed the Spyro switch case? I have the same one. Oh, nice one. The hell was that noise? <laughs> um, yeah, it's a cool switch case. I've moved. I've since. I, I hate to tell you, I've, I've since switched the switch case. Huh, funny. Um, I got um the limited run Castlevania anniversary collection stuff, and it came with a old school Castlevania styled switch case. So I, I'm using that now instead because it's it's very it's very nice. Oh, I was gonna say, are they just doing? three races, like the three races from each world, but actually they're mixing and matching them. I appreciate that. Because I'm, I'm guessing they figured that you would have, um... Oh, Jesus. I think, yeah, I, I'm guessing they figured that you would have, um, replayed all the races in order already. Ah! Um, to get the C um, CNK tokens or the, um relics so like they're like okay well we'll mix mix it all up a little bit for the because what's the point of doing a cup race of all the same levels from that same world already when you've already done everything in that world to like twice over to for the tokens and the relics anyway uh, yeah come on Got him. Suck my fumes, mate. What did you say? <laughs> no, that's Dinga Duck. That'll pick the wind up, yeah. I'm Australian. Yeah, 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 yeah. I come from down under. Ooh, yeah. yeah, baby. Better watch your six. <laughs> Time to rock and roll, baby. Ah! I'm on your he sounds like Pitbull. Yeah, yeah. What, the rapper? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. He does. Got the rock and roll, baby. Pitbull. 
It's Cash Manuka. Oh, why is he called Snoop Dogg? Why are they all dog related? Where's MC Golden Retriever? <laughs> Yeah, MC Pug. <laughs> Jay Jackson. So when they say OG, what they mean is uh, old German Shepherd. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God almighty. Commander Skittles, thanks for the 10 Australian. Extremely kind of you. Hey, Caddy, big fan watching your s since your South Park review. Oh, my God. Wow. Long time ago. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Random ask question. Do you like Doctor Who? And if so, who is your favorite doctor? I, I like it. It's fine. Haven't watched it in a long time, though. Kind of fell off of the Jodie Whittaker stuff. Not because of Jodie Whittaker. I love Jodie Whittaker, but that season was just... <laughs> um, I think there's been a few. There's been a... Well, ever since then, I've just been put off. I like... Mm. Um, favorite doctor? I, I, I haven't seen enough of the classic ones to comment, but based on clips I've seen, I really like John Pertwee. I really like... I mean, to everyone. Everyone likes. Everyone likes Tom. Tom Baker. Everyone likes Tom Baker. But I don't know if I. I wouldn't say he was my favourite one. I. I like Christopher Eccleston. I think he's really underrated. And you don't. What? Hurt we? It's like a very upright. <laughs> well, this is a bit annoying. I've just done this race, but. Because I'm doing the cup race. That would be different. Yeah, cup race. Make way for Earth Spices. Make way for Earth Spices. <laughs> Crash okay. Bandicoot, I came back from KFC. <laughs> Eleven <laughs> herbs and spices. What? Sorry. I'm on your six. What did you say, Ali? The racist pie. It's Cash Vanuka. <laughs> Thank you for the support, everybody. It means a lot. Whoa, Crash. Entrance disappeared there. He actually went invisible. My son is very good at turning invisible. He, he picked that up from his mother. As long as I don't come last, I've got enough points in this tournament where I should be okay. Eight. Eight, yes. But I'm I'm first in the um in the standings right now. But by quite a lot. <laughs> That's what about the sittings? <laughs> oh honey. I, I'm not going to. <laughs> so, okay, you can't use any item to block missiles. Maybe boxes work, like TNT and Nitro, but I'm not 100%y on that. I'm not 100%. <laughs> Oh, look at that. My son did such a good last I fell off the fucking map. Really close. Now that's what I'm talking about. Better watch your sense. Make way. Ah, okay. Do that now. Well, that wasn't my fault, was it? Do you know what? If I come last and then I don't make enough points to come first in the cup, I'm, I'm going to stop playing. <laughs> yeah, because because it, it, we've been going for a while. And I'll just have to re 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 um. Oh, fuck off. I 
behind you. No! Oh no, that's terrible. Okay, well, let's hope I made enough points. Uh, hopefully I was I was already so far ahead. No. What's the final standings? Oh, great! I won! Hey! I won by like six points, and I got zero points on the final race. So explain that shit. Ah. Uh. Maxis animates. Oh, wait a minute. Good. Um, Two dollars from Maxis animates. Notorious P-U-G. <laughs> I think it'd be Notorious D-O-G, but yeah. Oh, no. I've fallen. I can't get up. There's what? a lot of woofing as well, isn't there? In the songs. In gangster rap, yes. Speci it's a specifically gangster rap thing, and I'm not sure why. <laughs> Congratulations. Congratulations, you win a germ. Uh, two hours and a half. Should I go for the other ones? Should I go for... Are, are you awake enough for me, or...? Well, I mean, if it doesn't matter, really. It's up to you. Do you know what? If I have to go to bed, I have to go to bed. Okay, I'll do... do you want to play? No, okay, no, no, I'll do... Because I'm getting tired myself. I'll do one more cup, and then... That's, and I've done half the cups, which means I've got two gems, and then I can do the other two gems, and then the rest of the race is all over again. So basically, I'm splitting these in perfect, synchronized half and half. Of course you are. Of course I am. <laughs> Did you not hear? I'm crazy. A doctor told me. Uh... Engine looks like one of those novelty bins <laughs> that you eat, like, outside McDonald's. Like, <laughs> Aiming my mouth. He's horrible. Children, put your litter in my mouth. I like eating it. He's horrible. How's the view back there? Are you talking about people looking at your ass, Coco? I think you're a child. Stop it. Oh, I have no idea. Santa Claus? Move it or lose it. Attack your opponent, not your team. Could I get my 50 boosts? Let's find out. Going all right so far. What happens when I get a I unlock a character. Oh. Yeah, baby. Think I'll do it. Come on. Yeah, look at that. Total accident. See how far I can get the ticker going. How far can I tick the talk? Doing well. Funny number! Does it max out at 99? I guess. Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Well, we did it anyway. And we did more boost than we did in the completely empty Citadel, which was one easy little circle. So that's interesting. I was going to say, should I try flexing and go for the, the final um, shortcut? But that's a little bit too risky. After getting zero... Knowing now that I get zero points if I come... That's embarrassing. Okay, I'm gonna have to try it then. That's what I'm talking about. Mm, no pain, no gain. Oh. Let's pretend that didn't happen, shall we? <laughs> I wasn't even gonna I wasn't even gonna try and aim for that shortcut. I was just I was just trying. 
to finish the race normally because I was in first and then I hit the fucking ceiling. I know, and I then saw it. and then I was like, I'm going to try it now. Do you know what? With this being the first race, I'm happy to try it again. But this is this is really where I'm stopping. So I will do this. I will do this this um this cup and then I'll stop. Thank you so much, Ma Moza Longa Bing Bong. <laughs> I got a pearl. Aww. Oh my god, I can't take it. <laughs> Thank you for the twenty pounds. Thank you for the hours of endless entertainment in the depression years. Hope all is well your end. Well, it is. I hope yours is well too. You're like the depression years doesn't sound too good. Hope that you're okay, dude. I will feel better tomorrow. You're completely right, and I am not going to pay attention. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get this. I'll do this cup. Look, that wasn't my. I hit the ceiling. I, I, don't, I don't know why I hit the ceiling. That was a complete freak accident. It's but... Casper Bryson Kemp. Thank you for the four ninety nine. Oh, save the fuck. That is a good point. Yeah. Mm, yeah. Okay. Fair enough. You're just saying. You're just saying noises now. It's just. It's re not even registering to me as, as speech. Oh my god! Why are they so disgusting? It's Casbanuco. I don't know. Is it Brad Pitt? Come on, you, baby. Am I going to get the 50 boosts again by total accident? Yeah, <laughs> just you, you, un you beat the game. Hello. Oh, no. How did I get 49? Oh, my God. That's a joke. Hello, I'm Velo. If you get 50 boosts, I'll leave your planet alone. Oh no, do it again. Oh no, you got another 50 boosts. That means I give you my crowd and my staff, and now you rule my planet. Bye. Yeah, that's what's supposed to happen. You're supposed to magnetize. That's what's supposed to happen. So lame. Oh, that was a risky move there. I just wanted to sit because that will be, there will be boxes um, for the time trial there. That I know it. So I'm just making absolutely certain sure that, um, that it, it's doable without like a boost, you know. I know all of these shortcuts have to be made possible to some extent, but some of them are really, really particular. That one is more a case of I've got to make sure that I boost right before the edge of the ramp and jump right on the edge of the ramp. Okay, that was good. That was good. That was good. Good, good. That was good. That was good. I did a good, and I'm very good at the good, good game. And it's not. It's an all right game. It's like, it's fine. Um, thank you, Lewis Harwood, for it's the Casper three Luka. pound super chat. I'm curious. Were you ever a wrestling fan? Are you asking if I was ever a wrestling fan? Because then that's another sign of ADHD or autism. <laughs> um, no, I've I've never been into wrestling. I I don't quite get it um you can explain to me until the cows come home why it's why it's means something to you and why it's important no, it's nothing against wrestling i just don't see it it's the same with football i just don't see it i just don't get it um no disrespect or anything i just it's just not my thing i'm um, justin radabau thank you for the 4.99 hey caddy i hope you're having a wonderful night are you going to be doing crash boom bang or skipping that one no i'm doing all of them and that eventually does mean i will have well, no, Crash Team Rumble doesn't have an adventure mode, does it? It doesn't have a single player. It's a multiplayer game, so... 
Unless it does, and I really don't know anything about the game. Does Crash Team Rumble have a single player? Oh, unlucky. So it doesn't have a single player mode. So shouldn't it say, does it say on the on the box, for because I know there's a physical version on PS5. Does it say on the box like multiplayer only or are they planning a single player or what? That's a, see, that's enough on its own to make me not really want to play it. Because, like, at least Splatoon has single player and, and, like, a story mode and shit, you know? Oh, we're going into the re is wrestling fake thing. No, I do happen to know that, like, it is serialized. And I don't, I don't know if they decide, like, who wins what beforehand and then they act it out. I, I actually i am not too sure about that. I always, like, is it, isn't it something like, correct me if I'm wrong, isn't it something along the lines of when you want to get into certain leagues, like WWE or F or whatever it is, if you want to get into the big leagues, you actually have to win a proper fight legitimately, unscripted and everything. But then once you're in, all you have to do really is follow the script, but then do everything, like, properly so like if you get hit in the head by a chair you're gonna get hit in the head by a real chair if you're gonna get body slammed by someone that jumps off of like a diving board then you are gonna get body slammed like that's the stuff that isn't fake but then it's scripted at that point once you're in they then decide based on your popularity or your notoriety like if you stay for the rest of it i, I don't know how it works how does it work oh god so it's, okay crash team rumble is Multiplayer only says so on the box. That is enough for me to not it's even bother. But yeah, like, I mean, what's the... Uh, how could I stream Crash Team Rumble to 100% if there isn't a percent to 100, you know? Okay, honey. I'll see you in a second, all right? There's only one race after this, and then I'll be... Yeah, sure. Close. This is very close. Luckily, I've got a speed boost. Look at that. Beautiful. Yeah, so anyway, where are we? You have to get noticed by talent scouts. Okay. Oh, yeah, the risks are absolutely... I'm, I'm a fully aware that it's not, like, fake. I, I just know that they have to follow a script of... It's a show, crowd reaction, and marketability determines who is on top. I figured it was that. So... When they do the... Okay, so the, the extent of my knowledge on wrestling is fighting with my family, the movie, about Paige, that wrestler. So that movie is a story. It's a good movie, by the way. Really good movie. But that's that movie is a story about like how she went from nothing to then in the big leagues. But they make the movie makes it seem as though she has to actually win a fight and it wasn't scripted. Like she had to actually win it. So how does that work? Or was, or did they decide that she was going to win it and she was unaware she was going to win it until she was there and then the other person surrendered in the match? Or like, how does that work? Or is, or is that just dramatized for Hollywood? Is that just like boxing movie shit? M.E.K. Sama, thank you for the 35 sechs. Um, what do you think about the young ones? It's funty fun. The young ones are a major inspiration for my comedy. So yeah, I love the young ones. Movie took some liberties in drama, boxing movie stuff. I'm not massively familiar with wrestling. I've seen you know, uh, the matches. Are the movie keeps to try to keep the illusion alive, kind of. The matches are predetermined. That's the thing. So that's what I don't understand. So in the movie, when it makes it sound like she's like, um, oh, I don't know if I'm going to win. This is my one shot. But if they've decided she's going to win, then she must, she must have known she was going to win. And then she was going to be in the big leagues. Like, that's what I don't understand. Oh, yeah. I love the young ones. I got baited into saying peed shit. No! 
Oh my god, where's my ukulele? I have to apologize right now. Suck my fumes, mate. You sure are taking a sweet time. Keep away, mate. I can tell I'm getting tired and it's time for me to stop because I'm I'm running out of shit to say. <laughs> Good timing there, man. Well done, Crunch. Oh, wait. I'm controlling Crunch. Well done, me. Thanks, me. What was it that someone said earlier? I'm one of the realest people on YouTube and Twitch. <laughs> oh, sure about that? Whoa. That's an emergency break there. Oh, I messed up. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Okay, look. At least if I come second, it's team based. So, this is. So, this should have really been called Crash Team Racing, shouldn't it? Because this is the, that. This is this has got very similar mechanics. Well. Not, not similar mechanics at all. I don't know what I'm talking about. But it, like Team Sonic Racing, the whole idea of like... There's other people on the track that are on your side. And like it's about how well you will perform together. But then that's not really what this is. This is just if you win or your partner wins, then you win. And you can sometimes activate a power-up frenzy thing. Like, okay, the, the, it's not similar at all. The idea is similar. I can get away with saying it's that. It's Manuka! Thank you so much, CSDX. Big wrestling fan, I'd be happy to explain it to you with $2. Thank you so much. Look, I mean, I can't promise that I'll see it in the chat, but if you want to go for it, go for it. Explain specifically, just as just as using as the example, because um, I'm because it's the only thing that I can use as a reference. Fighting with my family and the whole page thing. So how did that work? Because the movie makes it seem as though she had to fight her way to the top and there was every chance she wasn't going to make it and she had to prove herself even though it's apparently predetermined. So how does how does that work? Like why was she why was there even a conflict? Why was she worried? Because it, she, if she was gonna win anyway and everyone knew she was gonna win, then is that just movie shit or like is there an explanation? Has she explained it? Or like is there is there is it common knowledge that she knew from day one? Like I don't get it. <laughs> I outran a missile. Holy shit, dude. It's a very stylized version of her story. I mean, yeah, I figured it was movieified, but if the basic rules of wrestling are every match is predetermined and everyone knows who's going to win, blah de blah then you can't just ignore that being the main rule of actually wrestling, you know? Because they make a point in the film to make, to, to note that like it's not fake in terms of like what actually happens to the people, you know? They, they make a point of that in the film. So it seems weird that they'd make a point of that, but then also make it seem as though Paige had to actually win a fight, you know? Sometimes the match result is changed last minute. So is it maybe a case of like... was So with Paige's case, is it like... She and this other person she was fighting were on even keel with who was going to go through, and they were basing everything on the audience reaction and how they work the crowd and everything, and then they decide as it goes on. 
as it, and then like I don't know the ref comes and says to the other one, "Look, okay, look, you're out. It's you're, you're done." I don't know, Bengal boy. Yes, I was in the most recent pyro video. I was absolutely. Movies played up for drama, yeah. The weird, it's kind of like the spoof biopic with Daniel Radcliffe's Weird Al movie. It's dramatized nonsense, dude. I desperately want to see the Weird Al movie. There is no legal way to watch it in the UK. I have tr there's apparently there's you can use Roku or something like there's there's a, no it's it's Roku's the thing, but you have to use it through another service. But it's not a service that I can have, I have access to, and I can't get access to it. So the only way I can watch that movie is by illegally downloading it, like. Streaming fucking blows. Region locking fucking blows. Pirate shit, guys. Because they don't care about you. Um, so, yeah. Is there any is there any legal way to watch that? Because <laughs> I'd love to watch it. And I'd like to legally watch it because I want to support the people that made it. And I want to support Weird Al and Daniel Radcliffe and all those people. I don't want to download it, but I, I haven't got a fucking choice. I haven't got a choice. <laughs> Use your VPN. It doesn't work with apps, though. VPNs don't tend to work with apps, so, yeah. Yeah. Also, I'm, I'm pretty sure that some VPNs have, that, like, some companies have been cracking down on VPN shit. I guess I could always, like, I don't know, stream it from my computer, I suppose. I don't have to use Apple TV or anything. I don't know. Yes, I will save the game. Oh, I see Wolfgang. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> use my region unlock PS2. I'll connect to Tony Hawk Pro Skater 2 internet. Yeah, I will save the game and then I will stop there because I'm fucking spent. I am so tired right now. Thank you so much, Deathback Gamer, for the five dollars. Hey, Caddy, how are you doing? I'm tired, thanks. And you just came at the wrong moment. I have a list of the hardest platform breaks in each game to me. Crash 3, Mad Bombers, C2. Oh, Crash 3, Mad Bombers. That's a difficult one. I, I don't blame you for that. CTR, Sewer Speedway. Good choice. Wrath of Cortex, Solar Bowler. I wish I remembered which level that was. That's a very forgettable game. Um, XS, Snow Job. I completely agree with you there. Um, Entranced, Wild Nile Ride. I thought Wild Nile Ride was going to be harder. But then I did it on stream, and it was actually one of the quickest ones I did. So I think there was another level which g gave me more trouble. I can't remember which one it was. Um, Crash Bash, End Ballism. Another good shout. What do you think of my list? It's a good list. You should make a video. Um, Ramen Wolf, thank you for the five dollar super chat. Um, Weird Al himself said he's going to try and get Roku to, Roku to release the Blu-ray, possibly 4K. Perfect. That's all I need. I'd happily buy that. Like, if companies don't give you a fucking choice, or like second-hand games and shit are way too expect like, inaccessibly ridiculously expensive, then what the fuck do people expect? Preservation is more important. Fuck's sake. And, you, like, you, I've seen news about, like, certain Disney Plus shows that haven't done too well, and, like, they have two seasons, and then they just take them off the service, and they were exclusive to that service, and no one's ever going to see them again unless someone's downloaded it, you know? It's, it sucks. Anyway, I am... G poo stream... <laughs> <laughs> it's Cash Banuka! Oh, okay. I'm going to... Before we go, I'll just read this. Um, actually, should we get this on a perfect three hours? I'm going to read this. Multiman37, thank you for the 499. Hey, Caddy, hope I didn't miss anything important. Hope you're having a good day. You're missing, you missed it the whole stream, so you've missed everything important. Okay, so according to me, I'm two hours, 59 minutes, and 40 seconds. The second it hits three hours, I'm going to hit end stream. So there we go. Because I want this to be have a perfect three hours, and I bet YouTube will fuck it up, and it'll be one second too long or one second too short. But on my software, it says... 259 55 4 3 2 bye everybody